Edwin. Hope you've been having a fantastic day. Here we go with the second part of this. We've done some of it last night, but the season one, episode maybe two, I think it was. We are currently sat in the motel, about to barricade it up. We're going to see what happens. Wow. Managed to get the Michonne. Um, Michonne? Is it Michonne? Yeah, I think the Michonne uh, episode's done as well yesterday. We got that done and out the way. So we just got this one to go ahead and do it. Let me just sort out this before we even do anything here. Welcome. Hey, Dustin Next. How are you doing? Welcome back. That was damn quick, bro. You were quick. How's your day been? I just need to get this little chat window out here this now so I can actually see. <laughs> but minute, he's better. He's not well. You're not well? What's happened? I hope you get better, my man. Go and get yourself a nice hot cup of tea. Put some honey. Lemon, sugar, get all that good stuff in. Get your body built back up again. Right, here we go. I've got that chip window open. Let's get this one as well. Here we go. Echo, thank you very much for that. Really appreciate it. I just need to pop this chat out here. Can't see any of them. Right. Let's go on to the story again. Like I said, I think we've just managed to get end of Ooh. La Bellia. La Belly? La Belly. Welcome. Thank you very much, man. Really appreciate it. Hope you're having a fantastic day there as well. So we need to get into the story. So let's see in here. We do got Walking Dead was done. This one is a play. We need to continue with this. And it did actually take a little bit of while to load up here the last time. It's actually went straight into it this time for a change. Right, continue. Here we go. Do we play? There we go. Episode one. Straight into it there. Zoara, thank you very much as well. Welcome. Right, so we're on to episode two, starved for help. Let's get into here. Get the old controller back out here. It's a lot easier. I think this is the bit that I just took a little bell. Previously on the Walking Dead. I know who you are. I got another good one for you. You've been all by yourself through this? Yeah, I want my parents to come home now. And you, you keep an eye on that front door. You're our lookout. It's Doug. You got it. And I'm Carly. Okay, Carly. You'll shift in with Doug when he needs it. You got it, boss. <laughs> Son of a bitch. One of them is bitten. We kick his ass. That's what I'm thinking. <laughs> <laughs> And I don't give a shit about what happens to you. But if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you, <laughs> you watch your ass. You watch your ass, pal. So this is just a little repeat of what actually happened yesterday's episodes. Right, this game series adapts to the choices you make. The story is tailored to how you play. So your choices affect the storyline. But whether or not they change the outcome of the game, I don't know because I've never been to them. Let's find out. Three months later. Okay. Ah. Uh, oh. Yeah, boy. 
He just took an axe to the head. Damn. What'd they get this time? Uh, looks like a rabbit. <sighs> well, that's <sighs> another <sighs> rabbit lost. Zahur. <sighs> I still can't believe I went through all that commissary food really in three it. months. It seemed like so much at the time. Maybe you shouldn't have opened the door. Yeah, except then I'd probably be food by now. Trust me, I have no regrets. Yeah, rabbit's hardly a meal, Mark, but I'd take it. We're all hungry. No kidding. Last night I heard your friend Doug laying in bed just naming types of pie. It was driving me <laughs> nuts. I think he's starting to lose it. He's not nice. the only one. Won't you cut him some pie? slack? Apple yeah. pie? You're right. Cherry pie. I wish I knew for sure how much food we have left. Uh, we'll have to ask Lily. Not enough. Um, not enough. According to Lily, we've just about hit the last of our food reserves. Some people might have to go without tonight. You mean Lily's lottery again? Kenny's gonna be pissed. She thinks everyone should have an equal chance of missing a meal. You think Kenny's having any more luck than we are out here? I sure hope so. Yeah, between the lack of food and Kenny and Lily fighting all the time, things are getting pretty tense back at the motor inn. You know, Kenny's been talking about taking off if he can get that RV running. Take that RV? He better off without us. He's got a family to look out for. He's got a wife and son to look out for. Yeah. Safest in a big group. Going out on his own will get them all killed. Can't blame him, though. Did you hear Larry going off on him last night? What's the old guy's deal, anyway? Seems the like guy, he's got a problem again. with you in particular. Beba, thank you very much. Thank you, thank you. Welcome. Okay, he thinks he's I'm just dangerous. an old racist he's asshole. Old. That's yep. his deal. Well, he needs to get over that and start finding a way to pull his weight. Heart problems or not, we should all be out here trying to find food. Exactly. And I know Lily thinks he's it's getting weaker, game. but the guy's all muscle. He's a walking pile driver. I know I wouldn't want to be stuck in a room with him. And didn't he punch you in the face one time? Uh, knock me flat. <laughs> he did. He gave him one little wallop and he was on that floor like a banana. All peeled. I've all forgot. Shoot it. You can't make that shot. Take the shot. We need anything we can get at this point. Shit, was that Kenny? I don't know. Come on. Oh god. You might have just killed Kenny here. You might have just killed Kenny. Jesus Christ. Oh shit, no, no, please don't kill us. We just want to help our teacher, we'll leave, I swear. Lee, you guys okay? Get, get it off, shit. get it off, God damn it! Get, get it off me. Travis, maybe they can help. These might be the same guys that raided our camp and we barely got away from that. What guys? Why the fuck is there a bear trap out here? Who raided your camp? I, I don't know, guys with guns. Please, we won't bother you, I swear. Lee, this is fucked up. We've got to help him. Please. Man, Why shut up. Get My dad was special forces. I know what I'm doing. Just see if you can get him out. After that, you can leave us or whatever. I don't care. Please. we got to get him out of there. Oh, God, thank you. Fine, but you got to hurry. <laughs> hurry, please. Hurry. Oh, oh, oh. Keep the noise down, uh, everybody. Lee, this <laughs> trap's been altered. There's no release latch. Oh, no. Chop his leg off. Yeah. That's gonna happen. I'm gonna have to chop his Shit. leg. Walk her now or we'll never leave. Please! Get me out of this! Mark, get the boys back! Kenny, keep those walkers off of me! There has to be a way out of this! Please, uh, do something! Uh, There's gotta be something we can do! Was that? I just, I Please, it's Jane! Get, get me out, out of this! Oh, God, he can't die! 
Let's go! Oh, Jesus, let's go. those things are gonna be here soon. Hurry! Ah. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Forget it! We use chain like that at the Air Force Base to destroy them out. We're not gonna do that. We can hang it in now! Chop a tree down. There's gotta be a way. Can't just leave him like this. Yeah, oh, he just cut off his fucking leg. This is bad. Oh, oh, are you nuts? Quit fucking fuck fuck around. Try something else. This can't be happening. We already knew what the situation was. He's lost so, so much blood be. already. Please hurry Jesus. up. I need to walk. Lee, I can't How keep him back forever. Oh, no, no, no! Stop. Fuck! Oh, oh man, oh man, I'm just wasting ammo now. We gotta go! Oh god, there's so many of them! Oh god! I'm gonna have to cut you out. No, no, no! Try the trap again! Anything, please! Can we just cut you in half? Can we just leave him? Come on! Get it off! Just leave him, we die. How do you get these things open? We don't know! <laughs> it's impossible. It locks or something. Hurry! Come on, we gotta go. Now! No! <laughs> no, don't leave me! Damn it, Lee! Uh, I'm sorry. No! We can't leave Mr. Parker like that! Give me the gun! Give it God to me! Damn it, let Travis! Go. No gun! What happened? He went for the gun! Oh, God. Grab the kid and keep moving! I would even do that. That's all the broken thing very much. Come on! Move! You can't leave me like this. Please get me out. It's funny how they carry the dead body that leaves him here. But why would you even do that? you had there was to cut his leg off that was the only option you had I mean as I'm like the only true option I would just mess around cutting trees and things I knew we wouldn't be able to do that but it's just weird how they just left him she a pretty good footballer Some style. Look at that. Oh my god, indeed, exactly. That's what I was just saying. Oh my god. Open. We've got wounded! Shit! What the hell are they doing? Exactly come on, come doing. on! Oh my God. What happened? Oh, what the hell are these Don't have time to explain. Lee, Shit! Are you okay? Get him into the truck. I'll see what I can do. Cat, okay? can you fix him? Jesus, Ken! Lee! I, I don't know! Lee! What the hell? You can't just be bringing new people here. What are you thinking? Hey, you want to calm down for a fucking hey, minute? No, I don't. The ones that shot him. I want to know why you thought bringing more mouths to feed was a good idea. We're the ones that shot him. Then you should have done the right thing and finished them off. What the hell is wrong with you? Come on, Lily. These are people. People trying to survive just like us. We've got to stick together to survive. The only reason you're here is because you had food. Enough for all of us. But that food is almost gone. We've got maybe a week's worth left. And I don't suppose you guys are carrying any groceries, are you? Um, no. Fine, you guys fight it out then. <sighs> Welcome to the family, kid. <laughs> well, come over really here happy that, see what I drew. Exactly. But, what? No, I... Just come on, okay? You know, 
You like to think you're the leader of this little group, but we can make our own goddamn decisions. This isn't your own personal dictatorship. Hey, I didn't ask to lead this group. Everyone was happy to have me distributing the food when there was enough to go around, but now that it's running out, suddenly I'm a goddamn Nazi. Kenny's right. Kenny's right. Yeah, you're in charge of the food and the schedules, but you're not in charge of people's lives. Really? You weren't yeah. there. Lee made a choice. End of story. Yeah, baby. Look, once Katja patches that guy up, you can kick him out of here. Send him out on their own. I couldn't care less. But they at least deserve a fighting chance against the walkers. And for the record, Kenny wanted to leave those people behind. If Kenny would pull his head out of his ass for five seconds, he'd realize that I make these decisions to protect his family. We simply don't have enough food. I don't see any of you stepping up to make the hard decisions. My girl's got more balls than all of you combined. Dad, please. Why don't you go help Mark with the wall? Yeah, exactly. You're the big beefiest guy. He's doing nothing, just putting wolves up. You know what? If you think I'm doing such a shitty job, then you do it. That's all the food we have for today. You decide who gets to eat. Well, no, I'm serious. Pick up that food and start handing it out. You see how it feels to not have enough food for everyone. Oh, okay, here we go. You only have enough food for four items for 10 hungry people. Nice. If you split it in half again, you have enough for eight people. Easy peasy. Right, let's see, where's the kids? Kids get food. How you doing, Clementine? Okay. Where's your hat? I don't know. Can you help me find it? Sure. Sure. When did you lose it? Let's I had it time. a couple days ago. I promise. If I find it, I'll let you know. Thank you. Okay, Clem. I've got to take care of some things. Why don't you go back to playing with Duck for a while? Okay. In case you didn't know, Travis has my same name, same jacket, same initials. Right. Here, Clem. You need something to eat. You have half apple, a little piece of jerky. I love apples. Yes. Thank you. Are there more? No, honey. That was the last one. Oh, um... Enjoy it. You deserve it. There's a little kid here. Hey, Doc. How about a little food? Uh, crackers or cheese or jerky? Mm. Crackers and cheese? Yeah! Oh man, I'm so hungry! Yeah, baby. We've got two. And the new guy. Well, we can't exactly give the new guy the food. Sorry, man. I know you just lost your friends. Um... Will you hold the damn board steady? I'm trying. I, I didn't realize I was getting this weak already. What do you want? A handout? Oh, I got 60 cents in my pocket. If you'll shut up and quit being such a pansy. <laughs> and food for him. You can have the jerky. Man food. Here, eat something. Thanks, Lee. Need any help with the wall? Nope. Actually, we could use your axe. Do you mind if we take it? Yeah, mm. give us that thing for a bit. What's up? Here, Mark, this should help. Thanks. Hey, baby. hey I'm the one doing all the work over here. You, you didn't think to give me the axe? Come on, nope. Larry. Give it a rest, man. Things are different. Being a racist is outdated. Oh, and that's what you think this is? Is that what you told him? 
That's not what I meant. Yeah, that's right. I never said that. No, that's not what I said. Did I? Whatever. I, I, I got work that. to do. In case you didn't know, Travis has my same voice, but a higher pitch. Ah, right, gotcha. Keep the last piece for yourself, save the last piece for somebody uh, else. Some of these people have gone longer than me without food. They're the ones that need it. Yeah, have crackers uh, and cheese. Here, Larry. Lily would want you to keep your strength up. I should shove this up your ass, but I'm too hungry. Oh, wow. I can smell that food over here. I hope you're enjoying that, Larry. <laughs> I am! Okay, there we go. We made the hard decisions. That was easy. Not such an easy job, is it? Easy peasy. I don't envy you. I don't know how you have the strength to do this every day. I don't have a choice. Lee, Kenny, I know I ran out of food before. Hey, it was a tough choice, but you took care of the kids. That's what a real man does. Your baby, exactly. Thanks, Kenny. Still, I guess some people aren't going to be happy with your choices. Ken, nice. Lee, come here, please. He didn't make it, did he? He lost too much blood. God damn it. I'm getting sick of this shit. Um, Ken, but... come back. There's nothing... Let him go, Katja. But... He just needs time. It's um, been a rough morning. He'd been that shot in the stomach, not brought. in the head. I he tried, a zombie. but he was never going to survive. Uh, at Hello. least he's not our problem anymore. What about the other kid? Don't you... <laughs> I said, what did I say? The axe! Hurry! Move, move! Shit, it's stuck! Oh, fuck, Jesus. Are you got to be kidding me? I got him! You don't. I do you don't. Use the last step to get away. Uh, 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 uh. What? Well, that was. Move, move! Disappointing. Shit, that was stuck. shocking. What was that axe throw? Kick him, kick him. I got him. Let's go, 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 go. No problem. We gotta watch each other's backs, right? Why'd you bring him here in the first place, asshole? Dad, calm down. You're gonna get us all killed! Why didn't you tell us he was bitten? What? He was bitten, and you didn't say a goddamn word! But he was wasn't it? bitten, I swear! Well, your not-bitten friend here came back to life and tried to kill my wife! What? Wait, you all don't know? What the hell are you talking about? <laughs> it's Nobody not knows. the bite that does it. You come back no matter how you die. If you don't destroy the brain, that's just what happens. It's gonna happen to all of us. You're all infected. We're all infected? Everyone? I I guess so. I don't know. I all I know is that uh -oh. I've seen people turn who I know were never bitten. When I first saw it happen. We were all hiding out in a gym, and everybody thought we were finally safe. 
But one of the girls, Jenny Pitcher, I think, I guess she couldn't take it. She took some pills. A lot of them. Someone went in the girls' room the next morning and... God. Oh, 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 oh. Duh. Company. It works. Of course it works. I told you. Shit, where'd this string come from? Watch where you're walking, man. Who are those people? I don't know. Who are these people? No, I died. Okay, I think they know who. I think. Are they the people that raided your camp? I don't think so. But they all had their faces covered, so I don't know. There's just two of them. We need to make a stand. No. We have to shoot anybody. Team. We don't confront them if we don't have to. You all right? Yeah, just getting untangled. I don't know how you're still alive, man. Sorry, Lily. Oh, we gotta do this. That's far enough. Oh, far shit. Enough. Uh, okay, okay. Uh, no problem. No, no problem. Uh, I don't want any trouble. Are you armed? We don't want any trouble. Of course, uh, n neither do we. Uh, I'm Andy St. John. This here's my brother, Dan. We're just out looking for gasoline. Looks like you folks got the motel locked down, which, which is fine, but uh, if you could spare any gas, well, we'd be much obliged. What do you need gas for? Our place is protected by an electric fence. Generators provide the electricity. Our generators run on gas. Look, we own a dairy farm a few miles up the road. If, if y'all be willing to lower your guns, we, we can talk about some kind of trade. How y'all doing on food? Nothing. We got plenty at the dairy. Oh, that's it. The team has been Lee, disbanded. why don't you and Mark check the place out? See if it's legit. I'll go too. Improve the numbers in case we run into anything dead. So, uh, what are y'all thinking? Thinking... We just stay here. That's, that is the question. And everybody's going to say they're just going to stay uh, here. No, they're not. So they're going to say they're going to go to the dairy farm. But I'm going to say no deal. I think we'll stay here. We're starting to develop a good vibe here at the motel. Good vibe? Well, Christ, daddy -o, I'm sorry the folks with the food supply and defenses didn't tickle your pretty pink ass. <laughs> we and need to think like leaves. a group, Lee. This affects everyone. Then we vote. If everyone agrees, then we'll send you guys with some gas to check the place out. And if we don't, oh, I didn't knew that come here. Then we'll stay in this wretched roach motel with your recreational paperweight over there. Plus, we stay close to Macon, where we have access to the pharmacy for Dad. Kenny, Katja. We go. Kenny, Katja. Dad. You go. betcha, Pumpkin. Doug. Go. Go. I say we do it. I'm in. Go. If they're offering food, we gotta exactly. at least Exactly, everybody's check it out. gonna go. He's the last one. Clementine, what do you think? She's gonna say we, go as well. I'm very hungry. Food is a very powerful right. weapon. Looks like we're going to a dairy. But at least be this on your head, that if anything happens, I said don't so, go. So, this dairy, you guys really have food? Sure do. We lost I most of the cattle, cool. but we still have lots of milk, butter, and cheese stocked up. And with the vegetables we grow, we got plenty of food. Thanks for coming along, Doug. Sure. I'd like to get a look at that electric fence they talked about. Sack here. Just want to check this out. Do, do, do. Uh, big shout out to Amigo, Starboy Sealed, Gene Genvo, uh, Mazano, and Is C Hoppy, Jay Nash. Thank you very much, guys. Really appreciate you it. Mike, give me some ideas for something I can rig up at the motor end. Can an electric fence really stop walkers? Well, as long as the walkers aren't completely dehydrated and the fence has enough juice, yeah, it seems plausible. The electricity basically cooks you from the inside out, right? I guess so. So, if a walker stays in contact with the fence, it'll eventually cook its brain. Probably takes a while, though. And that, that can't be a good smell. Unless it smells like jerky. And that is the problem. An electric fence with a zombie on it. But what happens if you've got a zombie with, say, a hundred 
all climbing over it. You just climb on top of the zombies, eventually breaking the fence. Man, I could go for some jerky. What's that you got there? Oh, nothing. It's just a laser pointer I picked up during our last trip to the drugstore. I mean, thank God Lee showed up when he did. Right, Lee? Yeah, why don't you tell us a little more about yourself, Lee? Where are you from? From? I grew in Macon. I grew up in Macon. Right here in the heart of Georgia. That's yep. what I like to hear. Y'all seem pretty settled in at that motor inn. Uh, who's running things over there? Mm, Lily. Lily. She runs a pretty tight ship. Her and her dad are ex-military. Yeah, she knows her shit, but she needs to know when to back off sometimes. How many people you got over there anyway? I'm not... Uh... Nine, including the kids. Let's just tell well, them Well, ten, actually, if you count the new guy. Well, we'd love to get you all out to the dairy. Like I said, we got plenty of food, and quite frankly, we could always use an extra helping hand. In the summers, I used to help out on a goat farm. Yeah, that's great. Everything helps. Mama's been running the dairy for well, as long as I can remember, but uh, now it's... You getting... think you're going to cut me out of this? Shut uh -oh. down. What's going on here? No one's trying to cut you out of anything. You and Carrie are always Fucking pulling this shit. Bandits. Who? Those look like the people who oh, raided my camp. Who oh, are they? Shh. Fuck you. Fucking you knew we were hungry. Real. And you guys were keeping it all for yourself. What should we do? Yeah, and you know what? We ate it all. What are you going to fucking do about it? Don't worry. Danny and I got you covered if something happens. But let's just wait this out. I hope they move on. Fuck you! <laughs> Get to the dairy where it's safe. Who's this Marley? I'm intrigued now. Up the moon. Thank you very much. Hope everything's going fantastic for you today. It's been a great day. It's not as cold as what it was before. Here it is. St. John Family Dairy. St. John's Harmony, you boy. Y'all can see how we kept this place so safe. The fence keeps them out? <laughs> you betcha. They fry like bugs in a zapper. We're pushing 4,000 volts through that thing with generators and amps. Oh, wow. You guys must know a thing or two about running wire. Had a guy who did, yeah. Let's see where this is going to go. We can't have a counter of the fence. Ever have any accidents? Nah, That's fine, they did safer here than out there. Oh, wow, you've got enough electricity to run the whole place. It's worth protecting, hence all the juice. I thought I saw y'all with company coming down the drive. Guys, this is our mama. I'm Brenda St. John, and welcome to the St. John Brenda Dairy. St. John. This here's Lee. He's from Macon. A couple of our old farmhands were from Macon. They grow them good there. They got a few more friends staying at the old motel. Oh my goodness, that place is pretty vulnerable. Have you got someone with survival experience to lead your group? Yep. We work together. Kenny's working to get somewhere safe and I've got things under control. We all work focus. together. Plus, we've got plenty of people with military experience. Well, that's good to hear. That motel ain't the safest place. Hold on, I, I thought you said someone else was running things. Oh yeah, I, I thought she was asking about survival tactics. Well, it don't matter. You're here now. We'll make sure you're safe and comfortable. We don't feel hungry. We brought some gasoline. Does the offer apply Does to the Does that offer apply to the rest of us? We're starved. These are for y'all. Baked fresh this morning. <laughs> Holy moly! Ed. <laughs> Sorry. Can't get stuff like that anymore. Not without a cow for milk and butter, that's for sure. That's right. Hopefully Maybell will make it through this bout of whatever she's got and be with us for a good long while. Your cow is sick? What's she... We have a vet. We could bring her here. We can help you folks out. A vet? Oh my! Our prayers have been answered! Maybe our whole group could come. For the day. Well, how about this? Y'all go get your veterinary friend, and I'll prepare some dinner. A big feast for all you hungry souls. It'll be nice to have some folks to help out around here again. 
Danny, why don't you come help me out in the kitchen? I don't know what I do. Something why don't I fishy. head back with the food and round up everyone for the trip back here? Might want to take someone with you. Remember, those roads can be dangerous. No problem. Ben can come with me. Take this. All right. See you later. There's something fishy about them. I just can't put my finger on it. Mark it. Lee, why don't you take a look about. around? Once you get settled in, I could use some help securing the perimeter. Is there a problem? Sometimes the dead get tangled up in the fence before they fry and end up knocking over a post. It'd be a big help if you could walk the perimeter. You can learn a little something about our fence. I'm gonna go top off the generators before they run dry. Come get me when you're ready. You betcha. This place is incredible. It's got food. And that fence? Oh man, that fence. If we play our cards right, this might turn out to be a place we can stay. So how do you want to play this? Before we can think about bringing our whole group here to stay, we need to figure out if this place is as safe as they're telling us. Right. Obviously, they think it's safe. But is it safe enough for the kids? I noticed they're the fucking swing over there. Not a big deal, but maybe there's other things not working that we just can't see yet. And checking the fence perimeter? Sounds like a decent way to get a good look at their defenses. All right. I'll keep my eyes open, and you find out what you can from Andy. The biggest curveball to this whole situation is... They've got no petrol or what is gasoline. They have no gasoline. That is the big kicker. We need this. Otherwise, the thing won't run. Where are they going to have a endless supply of gasoline from? Hey, uh, what are you fixing to do around the barn? Curious about your barn? Nothing. Just trying, Just to, trying to find more ways to help out. Well, I appreciate that. Tell you what, we'll find you something to do over there after we get back from securing the perimeter. Sounds good. Okay, let's talk to him. What's he got to say? Hi. Hi. What's up, I'm glad you guys decided Thank to help us out. I noticed back at the motel that you folks are pretty well armed. Been stockpiling, huh? How many weapons do you have? We can protect the dairy. Yeah, if you need some extra people to protect the dairy, you can count on us. Well, hopefully it'll never come to that, but thanks. Uh, I'll be the first guest that was the perimeter fence stops the lockers. We can't be the first people you've invited up to the dairy. Well, no, we've made similar deals with other folks, uh, trading for gas and food, but ultimately they moved on, looking for the people they lost contact with. Mm. An electric fence is enough to keep out walkers? Walkers? <laughs> Is that what you call them? <laughs> That's good. Uh, the old one wouldn't have, but Mac, he was our foreman. He figured out how to amp it up with the generators. We used to sit out here some nights and watch the sons of bitches sizzle and pop when they got too close. Closest thing to entertainment these days, I guess. These generators are enough to power the whole dairy? We got lots, and we gotta keep trading for fuel as much as we can, but they all work together to do the trick. Uh, like us. We'll fix that Mark and I can help you with that perimeter now. Oh, good. The fence will stop a walker in about three or four seconds, but... I just see this is in the way. Let's move up. It's overloaded if we leave the husks out there. You know, Mark and I can clear the fence ourselves if you want to stay here and finish up with the generators. Well, that'd be great. I'll turn off the northwest section, and uh, if you guys could strip them off and look for any weak points, well, that'd be a big help. Sounds easy enough. Stay attentive. You never know. You never know. Exactly. You never know what's around the corner. Another zombie. Okay, so now we're going to go and check the perimeter here. Make sure everything is hunky dory. So, how's the place looking? Is it safe enough for us to stay? If we can? It's pretty amazing what they've done with this dairy, but let's see what it takes to secure this fence before drawing any conclusions. I can't wait until everyone's out here. Everyone besides Larry. Why the hell did you have to tell him I thought he was a racist? As if tensions weren't high enough. Sorry, man. It just... it popped out. It popped up. He will work out something. We'll guess. work it out somehow. Well, hopefully he'll calm down once he's out here. There's one. 
Don't be near. Lee, it's dead. <laughs> Come on, let's push it off. Um, I'll take the arrow. But why is there an arrow on it? Disgusting. Uh, what's this? Andy oh. said when this fence is working, the walkers go up like a tree branch on a power line. If those lights are out, that means the fence is off, right? It better be. Gonna find out. Let's give him a little push here. There we go. Come on. I'm sure there's still a few more. Once this fence is patched up, this place will be a fortress. God, can you imagine not having to worry about the walkers anymore? Fortress needs people to defend it. It's useless without gas, exactly. Yeah, well, it's useless without gas. We might need food, but the St. John's need gas, too. Not many drivers these days, Lee. We could scrounge up a year's worth of gas, easy. So what's your take on the brothers? That's they seem to have this place tied down pretty well. Uh, we can take this place if we have to. The plane of Everbuto. What do what you, you mean? mean by that? I don't know. They seem decent enough. I just want you to know that I've got your back if anything goes down. That's all. No, Thanks. Talking about. There's another one. I see it. The post needs knocking in. Right. Um, do we push it? Looks like we get no choice. Oops. Choppy handies. <laughs> Choppy handies. You never get used to the smell, do you? <laughs> nope. Christ. I can't stop thinking about dinner. Thanks for the rations earlier. It's not easy eating in front of the kids, but it's all that's keeping me on my feet right now. You go ask for more to eat after. Focus on the task. I'm hungry too. I'm hungry too, Mark. Do you think they're going to be good for it? Dinner for a whole group of people? If they've got as much food as they say, I, I think so. Got fence down here. Come on, I think I see where they're getting in. This one must have knocked it over trying to get through. He's tangled up in there pretty good. Come on, help me get this thing back in place so we can get Mr. Crispy off of here. I think we'd get better leverage from the other side. Good idea. <clears throat> this is not going to go well. Pump it up. Let's go. There. Holy fuck! What just happened? The fences are on. Why the hell would he turn the fence on? He knows we're out here. Ah. Ah. Oh, shit. What the? Get to the gate. Get down! You asshole! Jesus! What the hell? Is we had an agreement. Now you're fucked. Who the fuck is that? No idea. Fuck! Now what? With the fence on, that gate is our only way out! Don't think I can't see ya! Uh, um... What about our arrangement? You didn't Not deliver the goods! Now we're gonna take what's ours! Come on yet? out! Who the Wait, fuck are you? Up. See him. Oh. We're not the St. John's. I already got one of you. Get out of here and face me like a man. Yeah, I didn't say that, man. I got you now. Get closer. <laughs> Give us the food. Behind you, you ain't going to fuck with us. Come on. If we can reach the gate, we can get through this fence and back to the house. You got ah, fucking oh, shit. You assholes! Give us the food! Close to close. It ain't right! We had a deal! What happened? Shit. It's one of the dead we pushed down early. Gonna have to move. You really think you can fuck with us? God. Where do you think you're going? I'm behind the tractor! 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 I
Are you kidding me? Another one? How many of those things did we push down? That's an you assholes! You fuck with us! Now we'll take what we want! Quick, he'll see you! That's a live one. What about our arrangement? We had an agreement! Now you fuck! And they're really out here! came on. Some people started attacking from the woods, and we got trapped between them and the fence. Holy shit! Are, are you okay? I heard Mark yelling. Thought y'all were giving me the all clear. Man, I am real sorry. Oh my lord! What happened to you, sweetheart? It was those bastards in the woods, mama. Yeah. I'll be alright once it's out, but god damn it hurts. <laughs> hey, y'all. Mark, oh my god, what happened? He got shot with an arrow. Christ, are you gonna be okay? Yeah. I'm oh. fine. I should just that away? pull it out. Oh no, honey. Come on. Brenda's got you. Come on inside now. We'll have you all sorted out. <laughs> well, you must be the best. What kind of shit is this? We Why ran into some people on the way up here. Bandits, I guess. I think it was them that attacked us. They gave us a lot of problems in the beginning. Killed a bunch of our farmhand. We were able to get them to stop by making a deal. What you do about these people? Food for protection. Not like we had much of a choice, but they did stop hassling us. Christ, maybe you were right about this place, Lee. Huh? It was just a fluke thing. We can't stop assuming there aren't bad people out there. What the hell Definitely. do you mean a fluke? It could have happened anywhere. Could have happened to us in the motor inn. Listen, we may have had an agreement with those people, but we will not stand for this shit. Ain't no way we're gonna let those sons of bitches get away with this. You know where these assholes are? They're hard to pin down, but I think I know where at least one of their camps are. When you're ready to go scope out that bandit camp, come find us. Let me get these boys. Bandits? Are you serious? This place isn't safe. We can't stay here. Not safe? This place is a hell of a lot safer than that motor inn. I think all of us and our guns can handle a couple of punks with bows and arrows. What we need to do is find a way to get our whole group out here to stay. Take this place over if we have to. Whoa, cool your jets there, Rambo. These are nice people. Let's not do anything to get us thrown out before we eat. I'm gonna head out and help Dan deal with these bandits. You guys to try to make friends with Andy and Brenda while I'm gone. Well, that's easy. I got charm coming out of my ass. Yeah, that's real charming, charming Dad. Welcome. Where's Ben and Doug? Since Doug ate half the biscuits on the way to get us, I had them stay back. I still don't think we should be trying to stay here, and someone's got to watch the motor in until we get back. Hey, uh, I remember seeing kids in your group, so I went ahead and fixed that swing while you were out. I hope you kids like swings. A swing! I love swings! Just like at my treehouse! Come on, Doc! Why don't you kids go and play on the swing, huh? Yeah! Thanks. Anytime. We're looking out for you. We're looking out for you. Right, okay, so we're gonna have a look around ourselves. But this is... The fence. Looking at the fence. They're storing gasoline all over the property. A bit of a danger there. Yeah, a bit of a danger. Let's get it in the fence with the generator as well. More fence. Let's open this gate. We'd we'll be going to take ourselves a little peek inside the barn. Because I'm a nosy person. 
If there's not enough room in the house for all of us, I guess a few of us could camp out here in shifts. If there's not enough room in the house for all of us, I guess yep. a few of us could camp out here in shifts. That's what I'm thinking to open the door. If there's not enough room in the house for all of us, I guess a few of us could that. camp out here in shifts. What we've got, we've got some more bill. <laughs> Lots of hay. Hmm. Enough of these might work as adequate cover for arrows, if that becomes a problem. And what happened if we put them on fire? If we put the arrows on fire, now we have a little problem. Gants. Not the bales for, uh, for the horses or the cows even. Looks like a feeding station for the cow. Do you want to talk to the dishes? Lee, oh my god, I'm so glad you two didn't get killed out there. Do you think Mark will be okay? Wish I knew, but I think he's in good hands now. Yeah? It's not too bad? He'll be fine. I've seen guys go through worse. How could you all bring us to this place? How do you feel about leaving the motor in? About your dad? I take it you and Kenny haven't made up. How do you feel about leaving the motor in? It's a welcome change of scenery. I don't know. If we'd just stayed where we were, then Mark wouldn't have ended up with an arrow in his shoulder. He wouldn't have had any food. I take it you and Kenny didn't exactly make up on the way here. I tried seeing things from his point of view, having a wife and kid and everything, but gambling with your family's life is pretty stupid if you ask me. Lee, I know you and Kenny are friends, but you recognize that he's not the right person to lead this group, don't you? I don't know. You're a good leader. Kenny believes there's still hope. Kenny believes there's still hope. Maybe that's what we need right now. Well, hope doesn't do any good if we're all dead. I'm focused on keeping us alive. Okay, what else we got? What's this? Gazebo? Quaint. Doesn't offer much in the way of protection, though. Quaint. Nothing else. Can't see anything else of notice. Got the fancy done. Bale straw. Electric generator still going. Outside. Can we check the generator? Yes, we can. That thing keeps the fence electrified. Anything else? I guess Mark and I were lucky we weren't touching this thing when it came on. Yeah, okay, let's see what else we've got here. Wood. If a couple of tools out in the open is as unsafe as it gets, we'll be fine here. Would have been nice to have one of these back at the motor end. Hmm. Plants of wood. Oh, but they go through a lot of wood keeping those fences repaired. That is it. Get okay, next. What else we got? Yeah, let's, let's see what hey, Clint, the team's got to see. Do you like the swing? Yeah, it's fun. Be sure to tell Andy thank you, okay? I will. Will you push me on it? Sure. Happy to push you on this way. Mind if Clementine takes a turn? All right, Duck. Let Clementine have a try for a bit. Okay. What do you think of the dairy? It's pretty. It reminds me of how things used to look before. Yeah, it does. Do you think things will ever get back to how they were? Yeah, I'm not sure when. One day, things have got to get back to normal. That's good. I hope it's soon. Yeah, me too. How you holding up, Clementine? I'm okay, I guess. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm just a little worried about Mark. Is Mark going to be okay? Yeah, I'm lucky out there. It would have been a lot worse. Are you going to find the people who hurt Mark? 
Then we have to make sure they don't hurt anyone else. Be careful. I want you to stay lucky, too. Ever since I met you, I've had good luck, so don't worry. Okay. Don't worry. We're safe here now. As long You're as safe. the bad people don't get me, too, right? There's nobody here. I won't let what happened to Mark happen to you. Promise? I promise. All right, Clem. That's enough for now. Okay. Thanks for pushing me. Of course. You're most welcome. It's all yours. Yeah! Okay, Duck. Don't pop a gasket. Look, you talk to you. They look happy. Can you talk to... Do you just seem not to kick to the face there? Hey. Hey, Lee. Found anything interesting? I'm just trying to make sure this place is secure. In case we decide to make this a more long-term solution. Except for those people in the woods. Seems pretty safe. Good to know. Keep your ears open for anything else that might help us. Well, it doesn't I guess uh, Lily isn't too thrilled about being here. I could give two shits about what Lily wants. Duck and Katja need food, and I'm not about to sit around that motor inn and watch him go hungry. You're with me on this, right? Mm. Lily's been doing a good job of keeping the group together. You need to back off a bit. Whatever. How you holding up? I hope they feed us, Lee. Soon. On the way over here, I was getting dizzy. Hands shaking, cold sweats. Thought I was gonna pass out. They've got food here. Yeah, but I'm not just talking about one meal, you know? Did Duck and Katja get here okay? Well, it wasn't easy. Duck didn't look so good on the walk over to this place. Well, if everything works out, maybe he and Katja can have an easier life here. That's funny. He didn't seem too worried about Duck when Larry wanted to throw him out into the street back in Macon. That's in the past, Kenny. A lot's happened since then. Yeah, right. I'm gonna go have a look around. Don't wait too long to help scope out that bandit camp. It'll be a good opportunity to find out a bit more about the St. John's and their relationship with those bandits or whatever. Right. I'll see what I can find out. Let's get out here. This way? Nope, we can't. Right, so we need to go and talk into the house then. So we got to see. Fellas? How you feeling, yes. Lee? Look, I'm really sorry you almost got killed out there. Uh, we should have told you how dangerous it was. No shit. You saw what they did to your buddy. Nobody's safe here until we start to fight back. But how? The two of us should go out and do some recon. Then we'll all mount up for some revenge. Hell yeah. Who the fuck are these people in the woods? We don't know. I think some of them used to work at the big box up the way. Save lots. Yeah. Anyway, they're nutty as all hell and get mad when they're hungry. So are you ready to head out there and find their camp? Yeah. It'll be a good opportunity to find out a bit more about what we're up against. Let's do it. I'll stay here and hold down the fort. Remember, we're just doing reconnaissance for now. No use getting ourselves killed. Are you going now? Yeah, I'll be back soon, Clementine. Please be lucky. I will. Stan Jr., thank you very much for joining. Welcome. Justina, thank you very much as well. See anything? Not uh, yet. Yeah. Musa S. Musa. I know it's around here. It's gotta be close. You found it?
it for any traps. You see anybody? Can't tell. Watch my back, Lee. I'm gonna check out the tent. Camp's too small. It can't be their main base. That's what I was thinking. Take a look around anyway. There's probably some shit around here they stole from us. Okay, let's have a look. We've got a campfire. Recently burning. Still cooking. Just water. Nothing. Nothing. Okay, let's try this one. What do we get here? Empty. Empty as well. Looks like there's not much here. And that's it. Tent looks pretty new. Anybody inside? Two sleeping bags. One of them's kid sized. Hmm. Looks like they were moving a lot of stuff. This one's called Save Lots. You get anything nice? You get anything? We What's get in the boxes? They're all from Save Lots. The first few days they told folks to gather to the Save Lots by the interstate. Anything worth taking? You don't know who the campus has. There's too much for one pair. Not, nice. Not unless you need a bunch of empty cans. <laughs> I'll pass. Yeah, what else we got? Ooh, St. John's Dairy. Boxes from the dairy here. Probably the food we've been giving them. Fuckers cross the line. Open up. What do you find? A video camera. L let me see that. Battery's dead, though. Oh, good. What else they got over here? Let's see if we can find anything useful and then get a move on. I see you handled that gun I lent you pretty well. You a hunter? No, but Lily keeps us all on a regular training schedule. Lily, right. You did Gee. say she was running things for you. Sounds like you picked a good leader. Oh yeah. Nothing but fuels. Shit. Uh huh. Empty. But it looks like someone's been eating out of these recently. Okay. And uh, over here is rubbish. Yuck! I don't need that. I think we've got everything here then. Chair. Let's have a look at the chair. Might be something on it. Looks like they expected to be here a while. And that is it. There's nothing else. Can't see anything unless I'm missing something. Is there something we're missing? Everything there. We've got water. We've got tent. Let's see if we can find some batteries. Oh man. What else we've got? We've got a bag. Move. Shit. My hat. Put your guns down. I ain't going back. 
You tell him Jolene ain't going back. Jolene. Hey, we had a Jolene. deal. No shooting Jolene. as long as we Jolene. gave you food. What the fuck happened? You had a deal with them. I ain't them. Oh, I know you. I know what you are. And I know what you do. You don't know me. Steal my shit. Steal everything from me. Who the fuck are you? <laughs> Who are you? Look, it's not safe up here in the woods. You gotta come back to the dairy. <laughs> oh, it's a hell of a lot safer up here than down there, you best believe. Now, maybe you didn't hear me last time. When I asked you, sweet, put your damn guns down. You think I won't kill you? I'm gonna take this here crossbow and put a nice, soft arrow right through your eyeball. And into your goddamn brain. You're not men. You're monsters. Men. All men are monsters. Take what they want and then destroy it all. Take a can of beans. Take a little girl. It's all the fucking same to you. Where did you get this hat? The little girl. You stole it from her. So what if I did? You stole her from me. What? Huh? What the hell are you talking about? You know what? I changed my mind. I'm putting this arrow right through your balls. Yeah, right through. Huh? String them up on that tree. Then I'm gonna head down to that farm and shoot every goddamn oh, person I see. Up? Look, there's two of us and one of you. No matter what happens, one of us is gonna kill you. Like you could kill me. They couldn't kill me. They tried. Killing everywhere. Take all the dead folks you want. We'll make more. Go on. Tell him, boy. Tell him what you got in mind for us. Oh. Wow. Okay. God damn it! You straight up murdered that woman. Hardly. She had a crossbow pointed at my forehead. We gotta be disappointed if this is thingy, Mum. That's why we're talking about the hat. It's a clean shot, though. Right through the forehead. That's good shooting right there. Still, what a waste. That's good shooting. That's great shooting. He was how far? About eight meters away. So, if he'd have missed that, that's it. Have been we going back? If they ain't here, I don't know where they are. And it ain't a good idea to go tromping through the woods looking for them. So, yeah, we head back. Once they see this, they'll get the message. Crossbow. It's a weapon. Come on. Hoping that's not Clementine's mummy. That was a hell of a ride, huh? Jesus, Danny. What? You ain't getting soft on them, are you? Not after one. what they did to your friend. You're back. What happened? Handled it, Mama. He did not handle anything. He killed one person. How many people were firing crossbow at This isn't what Terry would have wanted. Terry? My husband. Miss him every day. Then screw it up for everybody, then. Why don't you? Oh, calm down, princess. I'll do it myself. What's going on? What's going on with them? Don't know. Squabbling, looks like. A lot of tension with y'all, huh? I can't agree on how things are run. I don't mind that. Yeah, you could say that. They don't you exactly do see eye to eye on how we should be doing things. Well, it's probably just the hunger talking. And Lee, don't worry your head about them bandits. I'm sorry you've seen more violence than I'd have thought in your short time, but you all are safe here. Don't worry. I think I'll go have a look around. Don't wander too far. Dinner will be ready before you know it. And thank your friend Koch again for me. She and the kids are in the barn with the cow. That woman is a lifesaver. Yeah, baby. Go 
close that, okay? Should we go and give it back to Clementine? Nope, we're going to leave it in her pocket. Okay. And... What are we going to do now? We're going to look around again, I'm guessing. Hello. Glad I got to use her today. My girl here. You guys are pretty out in the sticks here. Hard to find. You get many visitors? Not anymore. Bandits, of course. Used to get these school kids on tours back before the dead time. Okay. How do you run this place with just one cow? Used to have more. They get hungry too. Or sick. Got your doctor friend here now, though. You guys must trade for a lot of fuel to keep the generators running, right? People get hungry, and a few loaves of bread fetch a high price. Y'all are luckier on this side of the deal now. You really like that gun. What's not to like? <laughs> He's a bit obsessed, really. Um, kind of creepy, that's all. It's just a gun. That's where you're wrong. This is Charlotte. She's as faithful as a starving ham when you got a bone in your pocket. I'm okay. gonna go wait for supper then. Hello. It'll be a good one. Suspicion exactly. Hello. Hubert, welcome. What's up? Nothing, my friend. Currently in the middle of doing episode one here. We've managed to get ourselves up to the dairy farm, just investigating to make sure it's safe enough for all the kids to come. So far, so good. The fact that we've been attacked once, one of the guys has been hit by some bows and arrows. Not bows and arrows, he's been hit with an arrow, not a bow. Please. Let's see if we can talk to Catcher, not Catcher, what's her name? The other side. I guess Mark and I were lucky we weren't touching this thing when it came on. Nope, let us go. Speed it up. Could do with some WD 40 on that gate, a bit squeaky. Right, let's see what these two have got to say. Hey, so what happened at the camp? Did you guys find any more of those guys that hurt Mark? Found the tent? We found a tent and some boxes. Nothing really useful. Seriously? No food? Jesus. What were you and Kenny arguing about when I came back from the camp? He's losing it, Lee. He comes over and starts talking about searching the barn and that these people are hiding something. But you told him to mind his own goddamn business, right? We are guests here, and we don't need to be overstaying our welcome more than we already are. The way I see it, we just need to skip the dinner and get our food to go. But I'm starting to think your friend over there has another agenda. About your dad? Hey, uh, can I talk to you in private for a second? Okay. It's been three months. Your dad still treats me like I'm some kind of asshole. Yeah, well, don't expect that to change. That's just how he is. How do you put up with him? Look, my dad can be an ass sometimes, I know that. But he's not a bad guy. He just... he's got a lot of pain. He's been through so much, and lost... pretty much everything. And it's hardened him, you know? Yeah, he's bitter and hateful, but that's all just to protect himself. And me. All he's got left in the oh, world is me. And that goes chance. both ways. So yeah, he's probably gonna keep treating you like crap, but that's just because he still has one thing left to care about. So don't judge him. And don't judge me for sticking by him. He's my dad. And I love him. He loves him. To be honest, I still want to actually just smack him over the face. Do you feel that feeling? Did you get the feeling something's going on here? I do. What makes you say that? Well, what exactly happened at the camp? Uh, it's nothing. Uh, don't worry about it. Paranoia just getting to me a little bit. I know what you mean. These backwoods people always give me the creeps. If you ask me, we should just get our dinner and leave. Come on now. We don't want to be rude. I'm gonna go check things out. Just don't get too nosy. These kinds of people are usually pretty protective of their privacy. Yeah, and we don't need you poking your nose where it don't belong and getting us thrown out in our asses. This guy. 
he's going to get us smacked sometime. Probably going to be a choice where we're going to have to either save him or leave him. But what have we got here in the background? Cornfield. Can you see this cornfield? Having a crop like that on hand must be great. We're going to need to learn how to maintain it if we end up staying here. The corn is actually used as cattle feed. Most farmers use the corn as cattle feed. That's what I believe. Hey, Garumba. That was a squeaky door, that as well. What's going on? Bossing Gay Gape. Welcome. Thank you very much for it's that. It's okay, Clementine. Well. You can pet her. It's okay. Go ahead. Chip Kai. Thank you very much as well for that follow. Really appreciate it. Whoa. Katja says Mabel could have a baby tonight. We'll see, Clementine. What's this thing? Daddy said it's called a salt lick. Yeah, but don't lick it. It's gross. <laughs> Did you lick it? I don't know. I don't know. Got to sound like my daughter, that one. Oh, I don't know. Did you do it? I don't know. Hey there, Andy. Yeah. Uh, um, think. when do you think, uh, we might eat? Hungry, huh? <laughs> don't worry. Mama's cooking up some good grub. When I met a woman in the woods, I was the cow. How's the cow? the cow? Well, Go better now we got Doc on the case. We met this woman up in the woods. She seemed to know your brother. Uh, yeah, he, uh, he probably talks a little more than he ought to. Thanks. Yep. Well, that was a little bit. Mm. She looks skinny. How do you like that cow, Clint? She's pretty. Here, Clementine. My hat! You found it! Yeah, boy. We found the hat. I knew you'd find it. You said you would. Oh, Hamid, Listen, thank you very you much as well. Give your hat to anyone. Welcome to the no. Grip. Did you see any strangers it? around the motor inn who might have taken it? No. Why? It's probably nothing. Just let me know if you ever see anything like that. Okay, I will. Hey, Lee, do you think you'll ever have kids? I'm um, not at this time now. I don't know. I haven't thought about having kids in a long time. Well, thanks for yeah. finding my hat. You're welcome, Clem. Do you want to pet the cow with me? Nah, but you go on ahead. <laughs> okay. What else we got? So we've got a cow that's actually very malnourished. Definitely Have I missed anything? Not no, going on. not really. Hmm, it smells funny in here. Like manure. What's manure? Duty. Duty. <laughs> Kids. Let's go get some duty. Okay, I'm just going to check the pens, see if there's anything in here suspicious. Nope, some more corn. Beds. Well, let's back out here. And then this one. Yeah, we've got a salt lick. Nothing else. We've got some bale of straw. I want to play in the hay. Just stay close to your mom for now. Okay. <laughs> I want to play. Okay. Oh, bye. He's off. He's not going to stay around. And finally, the third one. Bingo. Let's have a look what we've got. Empty. Okay, so we've got empty crates. Or empty boxes. But what's in the boxes after that, man? That's love. You found it too, huh? Lee, they're hiding something behind this door. I got a quick look. They got boxes of stuff and something metal and sharp. Don't get paranoid. 
It's my job to be paranoid, Lee. I got my whole family on this farm right now. How about you? What about Clem? You've been stupid. She's not actually family. I'll protect her no matter what. I'll protect her no matter what. You I won't. know you will. Look, the guy with Katya, what's his name? He locked it up real tight the second we came in. That's I definitely you heard a noise back there, Lee. Appreciate it. What? Welcome. My point is, we gotta know for sure. So go find a hammer or something, and I'll have this thing off in a second. You back me up in case them farmers come running. Hang on, man. Think this through. You smash the lock. Then what if it turns out you're wrong? You just fucked your chance to get a good meal in those kids you're trying to protect. Use your head, Kenny. All right, Professor. What'd you have in mind? Let me have a look at what we're dealing with first. Hey, Lee, you know how to pick a lock, right? No. Why would you say that? Hmm. <laughs> Racist. Well, you're, you know, urban? Oh, you are not saying what I think you're saying. Jesus, Damn, man, I'm from Florida. Saying. Crazy shit just comes out of my mouth sometimes. Sorry. <laughs> hmm. What? See those screws? Instead of breaking the padlock, we can just take off the assembly. Have a peek inside and then replace it all again like nothing ever happened. All right. Sounds like you got a plan. I'll hang around and keep an eye on that guy with the cow. Andy. Shit, I, th I thought that was Danny. Whatever. Can I help you boys Andy. find something? Andy, Danny. Uh... Kenny thought he heard a noise. He's a little jumpy, huh? Well, we're all sure glad his wife is here. She's a lifesaver, you... You got no idea. Hey, uh, do me a favor. Don't fuck around with this door, okay? Just, you know, mama gets nervous. Andrew, I need your help again. No problem. Right away, Doc. Let's do it. We're gonna use our fingernails. We're gonna have to use our fingernails to open it. Distract Andy to get him the barn. Okay. What have we got? Let's check these other barns as well. hell is this? Looks like a bunch of old dirty clothes. Ooh, smells pretty foul. Yeah, boy. I think we found something. We bad wash stuff. Mm. Let's see if this has got anything. No, this don't have anything in it. This one. This is empty. Let's get back out. I'm lucky. Let's see. Not oh, nothing there either. Some wood. Just some fence posts. Keep them inside dry. That's why they do that. Right. That's all the rooms done. Right, uh, Kenny. Need a distraction. Any thoughts on how to distract Andy? I don't know, man. Just look for something outside of the barn. We need him out of here. Oh, generator. Let's get that generator off. Can I turn that off? Definitely, he's gonna stop running. How does a woman like yourself run this whole place? Oh, I manage just fine. Plus, I have my boys to help out. I couldn't do it without them. Oh, he's chatting it up now. He's trying to mm, be with her. Check this chill box over here first. We've got ourselves a screwdriver or something like that. I'm just gonna borrow this for a second. What else can we do? Nothing. Hmm. Guess 
guess I'm gonna need a screwdriver for this. Let's go screwdriver. There you go. Take the belt off. <clears throat> that thing is on too tight for my bare hands. I'm gonna cut it out, we? There, that should do it. Fucking Danny, where'd he find this piece of shit? Oh, fucking thing threw a belt. Damn it, Tom. Ah, oh, son of a fuck. Oh, this is just. He's seriously. He's seriously just done that. What's that? Thank you very much. Welcome. Thank you very much. Thank you. He just took the belt off and the guy just did not know what was that all about. That was weird. Dogs lives. Welcome. Thank you for that love like. Really appreciate it man. Hope you guys are all doing well. Keep busy. Now let's get this door open before he gets back. Dinner time. Mom, Dad, dinner time! It's dinner time! Okay, honey, let's get that. Dad! Dad! Come on! Let's eat! Kenny, come along, honey. Kenny, come on. Don't make the children wait. I'll make an excuse for you. Get that thing off. He's leaving us to do this on our own. Are you kidding? He's the one that wanted us and now we're the one doing all of it. We're doing all the hard work. Damn, those are some not really tight screws. If only it was that easy in real life. Boom. Bear trap. Boy, didn't you hear the bell? Dinner time. Why is there so much blood in here? What the hell is that from? Look. I just came in and found the door open like that. <laughs> Probably my idiot brother. Uh, hey, was anyone with you just now? No. Not the doc? No, she went in the house. Oh, good. Uh, yeah, good. That's it, they're just gonna leave the door open. He's not gonna ask. <laughs> oh, Brenda, you, you wow. are an angel. Oh Excuse boy. us, we had to block the back door after Walker got upstairs. Don't worry, that was a while ago and ain't been back inside since. Everybody sit down, now go get the meal. Oh, this is a delight. I could eat a horse. Where's Mark? Now don't you worry about him. I've already brought some food up. You just let... Where is Mark? That is a very good question. All that blood in the barn? I'm starting to think that Mark might already be dead and we're about to eat his dinners. Let's find out. Let him rest. Mind if I wash my hands first? Bathroom's right outside in the hall. And be sure to get under your nails. You've been mucking around in the dirt all day. Yeah, boy. Mm, blood. 
Is that blood? Yeah. Uh, farm books, cookbooks. Nothing out of the ordinary here. Bad. Where the hell is Mark? But Brenda said he was up here resting. Yeah, I said this before. Mark is not here now. Mark has been cut. He is in pieces now. That's what I'm thinking. Okay, here we go. Well, they need so much morphine for. Morphine. Candles. Smart. Musty as hell. I guess someone needed some first aid recently. Ugh, what is this stuff? Looks like a bunch of medical waste in here. IV tubes, saline. What would dairy farmers need with this kind of stuff? Exactly, why would they need this stuff? Cedric, thank you very much for that follow as well. Really appreciate it. Welcome. Hope you all had a great day today, guys. What the hell? It's next door. Let's go and find out. Aha, uh -huh. there we go. I want to see a body. Jesus, man, did you find something? Aw, oh, sit your ass down, Lee. This lady has made you a meal. Yeah, Lee, what's gotten into you? He just had a start. He could use some goddamn manners. It's human meat in the woods. It didn't have to be this way. Mark is upstairs with his fucking legs cut off. You're eating him. That's crazy. The hell? You're scaring the kids, Lee. Lee, what the hell is wrong with you? Don't indulge him, Lily. There's always something with this guy. Yeah, maybe we should have done that then. Mom, I was eating that. What is going on? They're picking us off to trade us meat. You're out of your skull. Mark is upstairs right now with no legs. Brenda, tell me he's not being eaten right now. It's true. Everything could have turned out okay for you folks. He would have died anyway. We gotta think about living. Settle down, honey. Growing up in rural Georgia, you're taught not to waste. It's how I was raised and how I raised my boys. Now, you got monsters roaming around that do nothing but eat people. And for what? To continue to rot till they eat some more. We yeah. think we can put that meat to better use. Oh, I'm gonna puke. We outnumber you. Lee, that's not a very nice thing to imply. Yeah, Andy is right. We go after folks who were gonna die anyways, one way or another. Like y'all. Kenny, get your gun! Kenny, no! Nobody's going anywhere! We got lots of use for y'all right here. What the fuck? The fucking black Put your fuck? guns down! We're walking you out of here! Don't go near my fucking Mommy, family! I don't want to die. Mommy, what did I eat? We're screwed. <laughs> we? We? <laughs> you fucker! I'll tear you apart! This is 
on me now. Kidding me? Seriously? That is messed up. Open the goddamn door! You can't keep us in here. Open up! I will tear you fuckers Stop apart with my bang. bare hands. We gotta find another way out of here. Yo, dead fucking bastards! Open this door, goddammit! I will knock the goddamn Please, God, door down. Stop. It was a person. They tried to make us eat a person. But you didn't do it. No. The rest of us did, goddammit! If you hadn't dragged your feet... Come on, Dad. Now's not the time. <laughs> I told him. I said... What happened? You okay? What happened? The man hit you. They threw us in the meat locker. Lee, we gotta get out of here. If they so much as touch my family, I'll kill those sons of bitches. Get us out, you sons of bitches! Dad! I'm scared. Don't be. It's gonna be okay. I'm gonna find us a way out of here. So we got ourselves like a freezing cold. I don't wanna know what kind. Please settle down! I'll rip your goddamn heads off. The shelves are pretty sturdy. We could climb up. Uh, but there's no way out through the ceiling. Come on! Try us out! Cowards! Dad! Could there be a hole behind these pallets? Nope. No such luck. There's the more of us on the way! Close. Let us oh. out now! Do you want to live? That is not gonna... I'll, I'll break that damn door down! Dad, you can't get... Uh, uh, Easy! Uh, oh, God. Dad? Oh, for God's sake, not again. <laughs> no! Dad, come on! Dad! Oh Are god, he, he stopped breathing. I think he's had a heart attack. Shit. And now Is he, he dead? He's okay. not dead! Somebody help me! Fuck. If he's dead... He's not dead! You know what has to happen, Lee. Think about it. You saw that poor bastard at the motel? How fast he turned? What are you saying? Lily, I'm sorry. I truly, truly am. But in a few minutes, we're gonna be stuck in a locked room with a six foot four, three hundred pound, seriously pissed off dead guy. Fuck you! We can bring him back! Lee! We'll mourn him later. But right now, we have to keep him from coming back. No! God damn it, Kenny! He is not dead! Okay, maybe you're right. We can't kill him because he's not Maybe dead. you're right. No, god damn it! My dad survived worse than this! Kenny, listen! Don't think I forgot about what you said at the drugstore. When you all thought Duck was bitten. Well, I'm just doing the same thing. Except Duck wasn't bitten. And we know this guy's not gonna make it. Remember what Ben said. You gotta destroy the brain. Come on, Lee. You can't be in the middle on this one. What has you ben gotta have my back this time. What has ben God damn it, Lee. I need you! Please help me! Yikes. Come on, Dad. Come on. Lee! Is he breathing at all? No! No, I don't think so! Okay, let me take over. Keep checking his pulse. He's gonna kill him, man. Are you stupid? He's gonna turn! What? He's putting all of us at risk, you <gasps> son of a bitch! Three! You're fucking forceless, Lee. No! <laughs> Kenny, what the fuck? I'm so sorry. I just... It had to be done. You don't know that! Yes, I do, Lee. And so do you. I was counting on you, man. Wow. I'm sorry. I know. Don't you fucking touch me! <laughs> Holy goddamn. Are you okay? Is it over? I don't know. Not yet. Yes for now. Yes, for now. But we still need to find a way out of here. I know, I know. But you gotta be strong right now. I need you to be strong. 
Think about something else, something hopeful. Like what? That way, a safe place. Some place safe where no monsters can get you. We're gonna get out, right? You found a way out? I'm working on it. Let's try and find a way out now here. Some brain splattered everywhere. Yeah, we're currently trying to get this air condition down. Maybe this will rub something. There ought to be an air duct behind this unit. Maybe big enough for one of us to fit through. Does the air conditioner come off? I think I could take it off if I had something to remove the screws. The multi-tool. Hell yeah. Of course they took it. Shit. Maybe there's something else we could use. I've got a rock. Ah, a rock won't help. But a coin might do the trick. Do you have a coin? Uh-uh. What else can we use then? So we need to find something now we can take the screws off. What's that going to be? Let's find out. I'm sorry, Lily. He was still alive, Lee. He was still alive. Kenny okay, was trying to keep us safe. Larry was a good father. You've got to think about saving your own life now. It's what he would have wanted. <laughs> I think I may have found a way out of here. But I need something to remove the screws on the air conditioner. If you had something I could use as a screwdriver, a coin or something. No. What about him? Look, I know this is a terrible time for it, but uh, back at the motor inn, Larry... Larry mentioned something about keeping coins in his pockets. What do you want? My blessing to loot his corpse? Your yep. permission. <sighs> do what that. you have to do. Okay, okay. Do what we have to do. We need this coin. We need to get out of here. Oh, boy. Uh, any idea which pocket he keeps us change in? Fuck up, Lee. We don't have all day here. All right. Jesus. He's only when it's actually working. Nobody else is helping me here. Miserable son of a Well, here's our way out, Lee. Clementine can fit. We don't know which it leads, so it's more to fit through. Clementine can fit through. Looks like it'll probably lead right into that back room. You can do this for us. Think you can you do this. think you can do this? I'm scared. It's okay to be scared. We need you, Clementine. <sighs> okay. For sure. Come on, kid. You've got this. You're gonna be fine. What do I do when I get out? See if you can get to the other side of that door and open it. Zori Gargbo, welcome. Thank you for dropping that little follow button. Oh, what's happened? Come on. Hmm. That was close. Are you okay. Did anyone see you? No, but there's a man outside. Where the hell are you going? What do you care? Kenny! Lily, I'm sorry. We gotta Maybe. go. I know. I just need a minute to say goodbye. Yeah, hey, Dustin, how you done, man? Welcome hey, back. We're good. Okay? Hope you had a nice little break here. Yeah, this is good. Shit, he's gonna get us all killed. 
Stay here. Take care of Lily, okay? I will. something. Uh, the sickle, we'll take the sickle, that's going to be working. Grab that sickle, send it to the baby. What else we got? We've got the hay hook. Double weapons. Wait a minute, we can only take one. The matter of the meat. Talking about the cow. Okay, what else we got? We got some... Jars, Daddy of the Year. Ugh, I think I'm gonna be sick. That's supposed to be a head. Oh my God, what's wrong with these people? Maybe I shouldn't have sent Clementine through there. This wouldn't <laughs> give anybody nightmares. Oh well, we have to send them. So we've got three choices of weapons. Have a look for that. We've got the sickle, we've got the hay, and we've got the gun. Which one would we use? I know that I'm going to pick the electrical one. We're going to pick the stun gun, aren't we? We're going to just stick with the sickle to see what happens. Jesus, is this is where they put your people. Can you go up and go and grab a weapon? Go. What the hell do you think you're doing? Getting my family back. What are you gonna do? Walk up and grab his gun? Good a plan as any. Good a plan as any. Okay, that's not a bad idea. Got that one there in my hands. We have a choice: electrocution, sickle, or the hay hook. What's taking on? There. What are you doing outside the bar? Oh shit! Just guarding the place, like you said. Who's sitting out in the rain on the damn weird? Mama says we can't keep that many folks alive and not expect trouble. One to keep and kill the rest. Um, can we do anything here? Not yeah, these are cannibals. Imagine eating people. Oh, I know, Mother. This is my favorite part, too. When I let one think they can just walk right out, <laughs> they never even look down. I don't see him anymore. Where the fuck did he go? I don't know. Look again. He didn't go past us. Taking up the ride. I keep an eye on him. Give him an eye I'll keep an eye on him. Be ready to act when I say. See what he's doing now. I'm going to check see what he's doing. Oh shit. <laughs> Shot me in the face. I don't even realize. Grab the gun. Can I can't grab him. Wow. Okay, that was. Unexpected, but how did she even come out? Kill me again. No! Now he runs out. You 
See? You understand now, don't you? You can have me. It's how the world works now. Give part of yourself so others can live. I should fucking kill you right now. Uh, cannibalism. Not my volunteer for food. That's why you killed that. That's woman. why you killed that woman in the woods. She was about to spill everything. You want Mark. Mark is gone now. Mark we found Mark up in the butcher's room with missing his legs lying on the bathroom. We, they were just about to eat him. Ready to hear yet, Lee? Had to stop her. You gotta keep me alive. If you kill me, the meat gets tainted. You can't eat it. You're already tainted. You ain't gonna kill me. Just like you didn't kill Jolene. You don't have what it takes. <laughs> Fucking coward. I'm gonna kill him. This is not how the world works now. You won't make me kill you. I wonder what the choices would be there. He's gonna kill him. Can you run off to the... Go. I'll cover you. Just stay here and keep Clementine safe. I'll be right back. Hello. Hello to you too. Kitty! Hello. I'm Ali Keek. Thank you very much for following. Really appreciate it. Sorry as well. Thank you for joining. Really appreciate it, guys. Welcome. It's a laser pen. He's not going to try and set that on fire, is he? What the hell? Where's that coming from? Todd? Ah! Todd! What is the man here? Who's Dougie up to? Doug, what the hell was that? Morse code! You <laughs> almost blinded me! You don't know Sorry part. about that, but I did get your attention. We heard screams from the barn. What's going on? Um, we need your help. Oh, God. What happened? Larry's dead. They chopped off Mark's legs and tried to feed him to us. Jesus, that's sick. They've still got Duck and Katja in the house. And I don't know where the fuck Kenny is. All right, we're coming in to help. No. Mark. If we storm the house, we'll cause a panic. You two try to find a way around to the back. I'll head to the front. You got it. Come on. This way. Wait, are you sure? Yes. No. Mark was a good guy. Yes. Yeah, exactly. Exactly this thing. Mark was a cool guy. Didn't really get much of a story out of him though. That's no problem. I got a little, little. Oh, I'm gonna take the boy and take around. Oh, no, please don't take my boy. Let's go, woman. Let's go, woman. Settle down. I don't want to hurt y'all. Andy? Danny, is that you? What's going on out there? That is me. Oh, huh. <laughs> NG, how are you doing, my man? Welcome. How's things? Let me go! Lee, get back! Don't come in here! You get and they go snooping around! Go, Brenda! Please! Please don't you take another step! Brenda, come on now, you know you don't want to do this! Just go away and leave us be!
just died. Well. Houston, to go around, you? Go, Brenda. Hey, ben, how you doing? Please, things... please don't you take another step. Brenda, come on now. You know you don't want to do this. Just go away and leave us be. Been up to Ben, keep yourself busy. Let her go, Brenda. Right, so what we do here, Ben? Please, please oh, don't you take another step. Brenda, come on now, you know you don't want to do this. Just go away and leave us be. Stop. That's what please, I stop. please don't you take another step. Brent, come on now. You know you don't want to do this. Just go away and leave us be. That was just a wee joke that I wanted to see what happened. But she's got the gun. Why would you even say that? Let her go, Brenda. I don't want to go down that in real life. Please, just please don't you take another step. Brenda, come on now. You know you don't want to do this. Just go away and leave us be. About what you're doing. It doesn't have to end like this. It has to be nice. I'll kill her, Lee. Just let me go. That's all we get. Stay back! Don't do anything stupid! Let her go, Brenda. Please, what's he doing? I'll 
Like a man, Lee. They're getting in. Let's go. Recommend no subtitles. What? How come? Why do you think that? I thought it would be pretty good that way. When people doesn't understand what they're saying, they can actually read a little bit. Try and understand it. If hey Lee, don't. I'm sorry for leaving the motor in unattended. 
I never thought a laser pointer would be the thing that saved our lives. Don't worry about it. I'm glad you showed up when you did. Everybody's I'm glad dead. you showed up when you did. Well, we gotta stick together. Were they really chopping up people? For food? Yeah. And Clementine almost ate some. Man, that is sick. Clementine, she doesn't know, right? She didn't see or... I stopped her. This fucking world now. Tied in just unspeakable shit at every turn. Ugh. Were you guys able to salvage anything good from the dairy? Not really. St. John's took everything I had before the place got completely overrun with walkers. Oh, I was able to grab a couple of your things back while uh, Brenda wasn't looking. Stick. It doesn't work. You have any use for it, Doug? It's just a basic camcorder. A save lot's cheapy. Let me check it out, see if I can get it working. <sighs> How are you doing? I'll be fine. I'm just not as young as I used to be. Hun, go on ahead and give me and Lee a second. Hello, Nuggy. How you doing? Welcome. There's gonna be fallout. For killing Lily's dad? Yeah, I would imagine so. What do you think? Muddled Larry. You're no hero. You're no hero. You destroyed two lives in that meat locker. Kenny, you're not a bad man, but fuck. What the hell are we gonna do now? Come on, Clementine. Stay close. Lee, are those bad people dead? Yes, walkers will get them. No, we didn't kill them. We didn't kill them, so I don't know. They might have been able to get away from the walkers, but I'm sure they won't be coming after us. There we That's go. good. Hey, Dad. Uh, what's that noise? You, I am actually pretty good as well. It's pretty quiet here at the moment. Sounds like a car. Oh, God. Not more strangers. Uh oh. We could be in trouble here. What's going on? Wait a minute, is that not? Hello? Hello? I'd like to get nice and steady slowly here. What's going to happen? It's a bit of a weird place to park a car, to be honest. Figures. Empty. Oh, crap. Baby, you gotta see this. It's a shitload of food and supplies back here. Well, you know we're gonna take it, don't you? We're gonna have to steal it all. This food could save all of us. Not all of us. <sighs> Look, we don't know if these people are dead. If they come back, then we're just monsters who came out of the woods and ruined their lives. This stuff isn't ours. Dad, whose car is it? Don't worry about that, Duck. It's ours now. It's abandoned, Ducky. Don't worry. Well, what if it's not? Well, exactly. What if it's not abandoned? What if it is someone's? What is my favorite color? My favorite color is... Give you a clue. I'm wearing it. What color is it? Uh, we have to take this Clementine. You're right, we shouldn't take this. It doesn't really matter. If we take it now, we're going to cause trouble. And if we don't take it, then maybe later along. Eeny, meeny, miny, more. You're right. We shouldn't take this. What? Did you get some meal back there the rest of us missed out on? We have to take this stuff. You're on a tear today, huh? We'll survive without that. I don't want any Clementine part. and I don't want any part of this. We're starving. We Suit yourself. The rest of us are taking this stuff. Okay, 
What have we got in here? We got some keys. Look, nice. there's more food in that box. They have antibiotics. What else do they have? Any electronics? Radios? Batteries? Here. Got it? Yeah, I got it. Lee, there's a Debbie hoodie in car. here. Could Thanks probably fit that. Clementine. What are you up to? Candid Jap to She's good. Welcome Thanks. as well. Thank you for Whatever, man. It, it's guys. gonna get cold out eventually. Here, Clem. Want some uh, batteries? Why would she need batteries? Hey, Lee. You know that camcorder? I got it working. You might want to see this. Okay, let's have a look. Wow, they've been watching us. Wow, damn, boy. What do you play? Um, the car. I should, I say car, what I should say is, what I should say is, my daddy car. Oh, darling, baby, look at you. Look at you. Oh, you need a mama, sweetheart. We won't let them bandits get you, will we? How are you doing, Clementine? Okay. Where's your hat? I don't know. Can you help me find it? Sure. What's going on here? When did you lose it? I had it a couple days ago. I promise. You, wait, if I find it, I'll safe. let you know. Sitting there acting like things are the way they used to be. The dead don't kill their own. It's the living you've got to be afraid of. The people <laughs> I used to call friends. The people. <laughs> she's a little bit loony now. She's about don't worry, crazy girl. in the head. Uh, but how you say you doing, my mum? How was things? As long as keep getting food from them, you'll be safe. How's your uh, stream promise. come? Did you manage to get sorted out? A Halson. Ah, oh, sorry. Al Hals, Al Hassan, Al Hassan, yeah, Al Hassan. Thank you very much for the follow as well. Really appreciate it. So, what you stood in there? That's the that's the place my is done. Thank you for it's that. It's time to welcome move on to the group. Screw it. Really appreciate Not it, like man. Never listened to a damn word. Welcome, I welcome. Say. Is this all you got? I told you this town is tapped. Do you have any idea what we had to do to get all that? We need to leave. Duck was asking about the farm last What's night. Here? Not much phases. It's starting to add up. I need to get to the coast. Get him out of all this madness. <laughs> Lily's not doing so Ooh, good, huh? That was a shot. You murdered her dad. I did what I had to, and you know it. Maybe people out there got things lined up better. Better than us, at least. Could be folks who have all this shit figured out. Do people get mad when they're scared? Sometimes, yeah, they do. You're so full of bullshit. I'm doing? the one keeping this group yeah, going. We, go we can sort all this out, all right? We can sort this out. I'll tell much, you what we friend. need to sort out. Welcome. We can't let one person fuck this up for everyone else. Portuguese? Oh my god. Can you can you type? Can you write some Portuguese out for me? I want to see this. Right, so we got there. We go at the end here. This chapter we got Savior chopped David's leg off. You and fifty percent of the people who have played this game left him to die. So that was pretty. Well, I was kind of messing around at the start. We was like, yeah, we know we're going to cut his leg off here, but let's let's try another different action. And interrogation shot Jolene. What Jolene? Who is that now? You and 61% of the players had Danny shoot her. Oh, right, so we could have shot her as well. And... Do, 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 do. Pragrism helped kill Larry. You and 51% of the players didn't help. Pretty much half and half of all these choices have kind of... Revenge, you killed both of St. John's brothers. 61 players didn't kill both. Survival, there we go, 49% didn't steal the food, so I do have a little bit of a heart. My heart's really like gold, looking out for those people. Survival stole the food. You can't hear it over the gameplay, sorry. I said, write some Portuguese out for me. 
actually not Portuguese, is it what kind of, is it Brazilian Portuguese or let's click to continue. We'll do another chapter here. What time is it? Half nine? I don't think we're actually got anybody on tonight to do Call of Duty or anything, so do, 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 do. Nope, don't see anything. Elbelix Joshua, thank you for that follow. Really, really thank you very much, mate. Welcome. That's the third chapter done. We got the GGs, the hype, the sad, and the rage. The master rage. And so, I think that is the end of this one. We can actually just skip this and go to the next one. Or we can't. Here we go. Hola, hola, coma mi nugu, nuggies and noodles. Ma cor prefeta e verda minha mi e uma canta. Did I say that right? Come on. Tell me I said that. That was like per perfect Portuguese. That was pretty awesome, that. Out of ten, how did I just say that? We can we change the chapter here? Is this it? Do we need to wait for that? Is it second season now we're on? Yo, big witch gamer, we have got, this is called, um, there you go, it's right there on the screen now, it's called The Walking Dead. You can actually play this on PC, you can play this on mobile devices, tablets, it's, you can play it everywhere, it's pretty cool. Episode 2, now we're on to episode 3. The long road ahead. Let's get into the story, see what happens here. What do you mean, nope? It's pronounced Sham. Previously on The Walking Sham Dead. Me get the gates open! We've got wounded! I you want to know why you thought bringing good. more mouths to feed was a good idea. Word's getting out that you want to leave the motor in. Well, here isn't doing us any good. You should think about coming with us, you and Clem. No one's trying to cut you out of anything. Those look like the people who raided my Calm camp. Calm down, you're paranoid. Fuck you! Did you tell anyone out there who you were, or that you were tied to this place? That's right. I know who you are, and I know you're a killer. He's not dead! Somebody help me! Come on! We know this guy's not gonna He's make not it! He's not dead. Kenny! What the fuck? Sounds like a car. It's a shitload of dead. food and supplies back here. You're right. We brown you shouldn't take this. The rest of us are taking this stuff. Don't GGs, worry, little girl. Yeah, boys. That's what we're talking about there. GGs there. I think Long that's the next on the YouTube channel, them, boys. And girls, I should say, actually. Much better. Magnifico. Oh, that's uh, Italian. Sorry. Uh, por favor. Cuatro. I don't know, actually. Sorry. My Spanish is rubbish as well. I don't think my French is any better either. Parlez vous français? Well, actually, parlez vous français. If, if you're saying the French, why would you be speaking the French as well? Parlez vous anglais? Is it anglais? Anglo? Okay, here we go back into episode here, chapter 3. The long road ahead. Looks like this is our lucky day. Uh, this might go smoothly. I don't like it. Maybe. Let's yeah, see this smoothly. might actually go smoothly. We deserve it after last time.
<laughs> no spiders, yes. And I'm in lazy. Mas uno. O menos. You made up your mind yet? Enormous. About what? Enormous. When it comes to the getting the hell out of Macon, I bet you're in the let's stay put camp, considering I've been pushing everyone to leave. In Portuguese, it's. Un, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco, seis, ocho, novo, des. But I'm horrible at French. I can't even do French. I can do German. Eins, zwei, drei, vier, fünf, sechs, sieben, acht, neun, zehn, elf, zwölf, dreizehn, vierzehn, fünfzehn, siebzehn, achtzehn, neunzehn, zwanzig. Fine. I'll take Ola. that as a yes then. Ola, I swear, Lee, I'd be on my boat this goddamn minute if I didn't think splitting up was suicide. Oh, what am I here? There's a helicopter. And, I, and I'm actually pretty cool okay, with Hungarian. Just like last time. I can do some Over the rig, into the pharmacy and scrape together whatever supplies are left. We didn't leave much in there. Hey, we're out of options. Something's better than nothing. <laughs> So he's gonna go in this container. Is he gonna in the container here? Oh shit. shit. You okay? The ladder's come loose. Schweppes. I'm not sure how many more trips she's got in her. I'm not sure how many more trips we've got in us. No kidding. Right. So we've got a helicopter. Everett's prescription. That's gotta be a chemist. Or what they call a pharmacy or something in America. Yeah, but if you were learning German, you would you would have to kind of use it all the time, like, live in Germany, and you currently live in Portugal, yeah? I think you live in Portugal, don't you? So much for the military. So it would be pretty handy if you could learn. I mean, if you look at this here, you've got the ladders, yep. Now. Looks he's like she's ladders. What now? I'll find another way up. What would Better you do with those on. ladders? You would pick those ladders up and put it up against the truck. Get as high as you can. And old Kenny there would just lift you up. Easy peasy. Right, we've got a truck here. Oh my god, we're going to pull. So we're going to do it the hard way here. Is that a winch? Looks like you got a winch on the front. Sim. Oh, we got a flat tire as well. It's completely flat. I don't know about yours, but does that look complete completely flat? I think there might be a little bit of oxygen in it. Hmm. Why did I just say oxygen? Oh my god, I just said oxygen in a the tire. They're blocked by all the fallen concrete. Right, okay, so we're gonna have to get to the front of the truck. Let's get to the front here. Huh. Got ourselves a container. They're blocked by all the fallen concrete. You're absolutely right. If only they did do stuff that actually made sense. Like learning a language where you're really not doing use so good, it. huh? You slaughtered her dad, she'll be fine. Well, you did kill her dad. It's not good, I'm worried. It's not good. I'm worried. No shit. There's a lot to be worried about. She's gonna snap. If only I were there and actually did stuff that made sense. That's, you find that out all through your life. You're doing stuff that is, doesn't make any sense. My name is Dustin. Oh, Dustin Gomez. There we go, guys. That's our... I think it's our fourth uh, YouTube subscriber there. Welcome. Give a big shout out to Dustin there. Right, so we need to go back to the car now. I'm guessing. Oh, it's got an automatic winch. Well, we wouldn't I know it. Your girl still upset with me for taking stuff out of that car last week? I wouldn't blame her, I haven't asked, nope. I hope not. I hope not. Hope it ain't worth a damn. And there we have it. Let's go back and check, see if there was anything dropped. Nope. On concrete. 
There's that grocery Ooh. cart, nothing there as well. It's all pretty empty now, so let's climb up. Duck was asking about that guy at Herschel's farm last night. You should get really? a chat. That wasn't currency. sure it phased him. Of course it did. Still, he will never get over that. It was a scary situation for him. It was a him. scary situation for him. Sean dying and all. I'm okay. just worried he'll always think it was him. Ah. The chat currency, I, th I believe they did have like okay, chat, chat points for Twitch. But when I was... um. Affiliated when I was affiliated with um, you, not YouTube, uh, Twitch. When I was affiliated with them, they gave you points, but because I am multi streaming on different platforms, you're not allowed. So I had to hand in the affiliation link. So that's why I had to stream on everything instead. Everybody gets to see it, not one platform. His fault. It's a bit disappointing though. That was pretty cool. People, people used to make me do sit-ups and press-ups and push-ups and all sorts of things. You're sure you're up for this? Lee, I'm fine. I've got this. Give me your hand. Uh, oh, shit. Are you kidding me? Why would he even do that? <sighs> what the hell happened? Oh, nice one. Next time I'm bringing Ben. Help me get out. Oh. Go, go, away! go, go. Oh, for Jesus. Help me! Somebody help me! Oh, God! Oh, God! What the, what the hell is that? A walker? Walkers don't scream, do they? Jesus, I don't think so. <laughs> Doesn't matter, we must keep running. This guy will have to help. It's a girl. We have to help her. How? There's no getting to her. We gotta do something. Fuck. We gotta shoot her. Put her out of this misery. You don't know we're here. What do you mean? I mean, we leave her alive and she draws them all too. Buying us time. Yeah. Think about it. We're always worrying about the ones we can't see. She stays alive and brings them all out of their holes. Good. Let's go. She'll keep me busy. Oh, you missed the message. Oh, you uh, deleted. Oh, massive. Thank you very much for the follow. Well. Maretin, thank you as well for the follow. Really appreciate you guys, welcome. And the log the logical should be good to there. clear this place out. We ain't got right. all day. She's Get everything you can out of these racks. Don't forget underneath the counter this time. I'll clear down here and then we gotta go. Okay, let's do this. Grab. 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 What the hell happened there? I never done that. I got grab. I grab this, come on. Uh, what else have we got here? More. She's gone. There's not much time now. Okay, what else we got? Anything else more? Come on. Is he gonna leave me? 
again. Didn't you? Okay, I'm obviously gonna get in trouble even more. Can't believe it's February already. I know, tell me about it. It is already flying. It's almost Christmas. Would you believe what not? In a couple of months is nearly Christmas. What are we gonna get this time? Looks like somebody's been target practicing on the wall. Your channel should have more views. You are pro. Oh, thank you very much, uh, Dustin. Really appreciate it, my man. A lot of my subscribers and that are from different countries. So, like, right now I'm actually online. Eh, sorry, I'm online, but they're not. So what You're tends back. to happen is they then watch it back later. Then found some stickers in a drawer, and I put them on my so wall. So big shout out to all those guys. Hey, really appreciate it. That's neat. I'll find you in a minute. What happened there? We found something. Do I have a stream schedule? Looks like we got the kid on watch again. What'd you get? We might as well leave a sign out that says the men are gone. Come and rape our women and kind children. Of, and I kind of don't. Because I actually so, work what did you get? full time. So I have to. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Nothing. What was left? A lot, a of, lot stuff. of stuff. We're fine, by the way. Nice work. This will keep yes. us going. If we carry on like this, we'll get through the winter here. The winter? We'll freeze our asses off here. Because <laughs> piling into an RV with you after what you did to my dad is so appealing. Why wouldn't it be? You know, I'll do what it takes to keep everyone safe. We're already safe. We have to go Take a look at the wall, Lily. Lily. That's um, not graffiti. Those are bullet holes. And we got enough arrow shafts oh. sticking out of it to dry our laundry. And that's all beside the fact that Macon is busting at the seams with walkers. We have to go eventually, Lily. So you changed your mind. I know, Lee. I know. Eventually is well, different. He's not so, you two are, uh, having a disagreement? Cool it, Doug. Don't boss people around. It could be worse. I'm sorry. Somebody needs we're to make executive decisions together. for the group, though. And I don't think you're capable anymore. We're strongest together. Exactly. I know you Tell think her. I'm on her side, but there are no sides, damn it. What about the food situation? What about protection? What about when this place falls? Somebody's got to be thinking about this shit. How has this not been working? We have everything we need. Because of me, Lily. No, because Lee knows how to take care of people, like not just things. What about medicine? What about Ooh. medicine? We deal with shit as it comes, just like we always do. And when 15 bandits hop over that wall in the middle of the night? What then? You just gonna deal with that? Boy. Everything that happens to us is another excuse for you to pull this crap about leaving. All I want is a week of peace, of not hearing it. Do you know how we got these supplies? Your pal and I got lucky and let a girl get eaten out there. What? Some girl came screaming out of an alley. She had dead hanging all over her. She gave us enough time to get everything we could out of the drugstore. And you just let her suffer like what? Like bait? She was God, dead. What is happening? She was dead anyway. It made the most sense in the moment. Lee's right. We've been putting our lives on the line doing these runs into the city. You wouldn't believe the shit we see. We all appreciate it, Ken. Look, Macon and its people aren't savable. It's not a town. It's full of walkers. And the people who were left are dying and wandering out onto the streets. It's hell on earth. And it's coming. This way. It's not going to be easier out on the road! How would you know? What I know? I know you're not above murder. I know somebody has been stealing our supplies. That's right, stealing. And I know the list of people I can trust here gets smaller every day. Now everybody get out. Everybody.
everybody out. Okay, we're out. Happy Kenny. She's right. She'll get over it. She'll get over it? She'll get over it. She's riling everybody up otherwise. You understand, Ken. All I know is, whenever this shit happens, I'm the fucking bad guy. I'd like a thank you for once. For once! Uh, exactly. Rough What's day, I guess. Yeah, but I've just been calling them days lately. That's what we I don't do. know what it is, but it's probably worth talking to Lily about things going missing. Ever since her dad died, she's been a live wire. And now, if she's paranoid, that's a bad mix. <laughs> uh, BGMI, how are you? Hello, welcome, welcome. How are you doing? Good to see you again. What's up, bro? Right, let's go and speak to all these dudes, see what they've got to say. Where's my little girl? Here she is, Clementine. Let's see what Clementine's got to say. Hey, Clementine. Hey, Lee. <coughs> What's your favourite pen? Your favourite pen? What's your favourite pen? Have I missed the question there? What is the best thing to do when you are bored and can't access tech? Imagination. What's that you're working on, Clem? That it's is called the a leaf rubbing. My you're teacher, bored. Miss Moore, showed us how to do them when we went to the botanical garden once. Do you like football? See, it's the same. Um, kind of. Oh, you, that's uh, really big love to you as well, there. I'll make one big for love. you too. Thank you very much. Do you like it here? Do you like it here? I don't like it here. Do you want to leave? Where are we going? Somewhere else. I don't know. Maybe if I knew where? Yeah. That'd be a good thing to know. That would be a good thing to, to know. Later, where are we going to go? Okay. That is the question. Where do we go here? Deal pay dollars. Thank you very much for that follow as well. Big love, guys. So do you like football? Nuggies. How's the drawing? Good. Yes. Okay, what is your favourite team? Hey, you two. How are you doing? We're okay. Just having a little spat. We all like carry English guns football? now, and well, I don't or like Spanish it. Spanish football or Italian football? It's the way football? it's gotta be. I know, French football? but I'm not getting used to it. I'm sorry. How are you, Lee? Hey. Uh, you guys trust everyone here. Uh, they're about the guns. We need to try harder with Lily. Let's you just guys go through uh, them all one by one. Trust everyone here? More or less. I obviously have my problems with Lily, but I don't distrust her. Yeah, we can't turn on each other any more than we have. Oh, we can't, can we? We have to carry on, don't we? Okay, well, let's try about the guns. About the guns. Don't you start. I just wanted to say, Cat, it's probably good they make you uncomfortable. Thank you, Lee. <sighs> okay, let me just pause this here. So, when I was younger, what I used to do, me and my friend would pick a league, say like the Scottish League or, or Italian or English League, we would write down every name of the top Premier, Premiership teams. So we'd write down the Aberdeen, Celtic Rangers, blah, 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 blah. And then we, what we would do is cut them out into little squares. So we would we would put them into a bowl and then we'd mix them all up. And then what we would do is we'd draw them like a cup, like a cup draw. You just pull one out of the hat. Okay, Celtic versus one other team, Hearts, put that down and carry on with all the other teams, put them all down on the, on the floor. And then what we'd do is get a couple of dice. So we would, and then we'd roll them one dice each and then we'd roll for to see what the score is so we throw it and if it was a one or a five it would be like celtic one and then you throw the other dice for the next one it would be three hearts three and then what you do is write them down on a paper piece of paper what the score was and then you have to make your own league table as well that's what we used to do that was i'm talking about imagination when we didn't have computers that's what we had to do but we need them there's no doubt about that that was awesome I don't know how many times I cheated. You need to try harder with Lily. You guys gotta straighten this out. 
I don't know how straight we can get it given all that's happened. So yeah, what then? That we've Time had will come. We'll stream. have to do what's best for our families. Old style that's what cup we'll draw. Do. Come I'll and talk see to who you wins later. the league. Right, okay, I think they've finished with talking here. Let's see who else we can talk to. Doug is weird, but I like him. Doug is a saviour. Doug saved our asses that time. Who is this? Can't see hey, him. Doug. Oh, there we go. There's Doug. There's your, there's your man. There's your main man right there. Do you feel safe here? Let's Do you feel go. safe here? Hmm. Safety has always been a bit of an elusive thing for me. I mean at the motel, as opposed to finding somewhere new. I think if we can get whoever's out there to leave us alone, together, this is a good draw place to be. Whole league. And you know, they sort of stopped attacking. And see who wins Maybe the Maybe they forgot about us. Yes, yeah, so who wins the cup? What do you guys think about Lily? What do you think about Lily? Doug. I don't know. I guess I'm sad. Nobody deserves to lose their parent like that. You don't think that would make her delusional, do you? I think it could make you anything. Nothing good. What are you working on? I'm just trying to focus on the wall. Anything I'd like to contribute needs batteries or tools I just don't have. I'm tearing down this furniture to patch up the wall. If we go on like this, we'll have half the Travelier piled up out here before we know it. The wall's important. I guess. I feel worthless on watch because I'm not wild about guns and... I just wish I was more helpful. I'll catch you later, Doug. I'll catch you later, Doug. That's it, Doug's off. Now, who else we got? We got... Oh, the new guy. The guy that didn't actually hey, come with us. What's up, Lee? Uh, did you ever come down? Did you ever come down here to making much? I didn't have much reason to. My parents would let me take the car into the city on the weekend. But what's in Macon? It's kind of a waste of time compared to Atlanta. I grew up in Nikon. Oh. Whoops. I didn't mean to say it's crappy or anything. <laughs> he just did say it's it was crappy. It's super nice. <laughs> I mean, not now, but I bet it was. Is. Dustin, this is you, innit? This is you. With a deeper voice, as you said before. What do you think about Lily? This is what I'm thinking now. She scares the a crap out of me. Pitched. That's a reasonable thing to feel. I'm just worried she's going to snap. Do you feel... You feel useful to the group? What? Useful? Yeah, how's your spirits? I'm fine. I'm helping, right? For sure, Ben. Have you seen anything weird on the watch? Is there anybody out there up to anything? Nope. Really quiet. No. Really? Not seen anybody? Yeah, totally. Which is good. Talk to you later, Ben. Bye. Right, so that is them talk to, that's that. Missing one person. She's got. Why would they block all this off? Maybe there's something over this way. Mm. Nope. Don't see anything. Okay, so looks like we have to go all the way around the camper van to get to the other side. Let's see. Let's Sounds look. like Kenny actually has that thing running. I'll believe it when I see it. What's your favourite game? What is your favorite? What is my favorite game? Oh, that is a tough one. I tell you what. It's Lily's room. Most recent favorite game that I have played. I think I've got to say God of War. I love that. That was an awesome game. The thing is, let me just see if I can actually put it back I'm up sorry. again. You don't have to apologize. Did you come in here to give me hell or to coddle me? Yeah, I'm following up about stolen supplies. I wanted to follow up on what you said about stolen supplies. Shit, just went Do past you know us. what's going on? I don't. I just heard you mention it. Things are missing, and I could use your help. There's a traitor. Somebody, one of us, out there. He or she or they have been taking things. Paranoia isn't going to help us. You haven't really been sleeping. Don't start in on that. You've been through a trauma, and you're not taking care of yourself. Counts all the good stuff. 
antibiotics, oxy, for night, for about... fuck, anything with opium in it. I see Two the numbers. count, and it's fine. I keep my own. That one's getting messed with. I'm a fucking mess right now, but I'm not stupid. I know what happens if I start a witch hunt. So you want me to start one? I want you to poke around. Looks like What's we're going to some trouble on? here. I found this tossed into the garbage. Huh. We don't toss out equipment, we fix it. You'd only try to get rid of a flashlight if you were using it when you shouldn't. Why would you do that? Okay, I'll poke around. Seems like you're manufacturing this from nothing. Prove me wrong. I'd really appreciate it. A mystery. Jesus, Doc. <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, I heard you guys talking. You need to unhear all of that. Yeah, boy. Can I help? He's listening in to what did I just say? You're the Grace Detective, and I can be Dick Grayson, your ward. That's Robin. I know who it is. That's <laughs> Robin. <laughs> Fine, you're Robin. No tell anybody you're in trouble, okay? Well, here we go. Okay, you're Robin. Yes. Let's what get this kid in action. I, I don't know. Go look around. And, uh, let me know if you find anything weird. I'm on the case. What? When? Actually, when the best game I said was God of War. There was so many. I actually, end up getting the Horizon Zero Dawn. Don't know if you've ever played that one. That one was fantastic. Beautiful graphics in that. Good story. Loved it. That was another one. You gotta try stuff like that. Hopefully I can actually get playing that after. I mean I've got so many games that I need to actually go and play. I would sorry, I would like to play if I have a time. Right, let's speak to everybody. Let's see what they've got to say. You think about Doug? You didn't accidentally break a flashlight, did you? No. Did Duck say I did? No. Did uh, Duck break the flashlight? I don't think so. He's just always blaming me for stuff. Like what? Putting a bug on his pillow. Did you do that? <laughs> yes. <laughs> what do you think about Doug? She's a little mischief. He's cool. Cool. He knows things. You don't think he seems down? Like sad? Yeah. Everyone is. You? I'm okay. I'll talk to you later, Clem. Okay. I don't think so. Okay. And Clem is sorted. Let's find somebody else to talk to. Who is our mystery thief? Where is everybody? Okay, let's speak to these two. Do you guys know anything about this broken flashlight? Fuck. We don't got many of those. Yeah, it's a problem. The glass and the bulb are all busted out. I saw some broken glass over by the ice machine. I meant to clean it up before the kids hurt themselves on it. I forgot, though. This color is my favorite color. What do you think? Hi, guys. Hi, Lee. Nope. Nobody wants to speak to me. Okay. Let's find somebody else. Hey, Doug. Hiya. Do you know anything about this flashlight? Well, I can tell oh, you... Wait, 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 wait. I know you know everything about this flashlight. I'm asking if you know how it got busted. Lily found it in the dumpster. Oh, no. No, I don't. I'll keep my eye out for some suitable parts, though. That'll give me something useful to do. Which team do you think I support now? A flashlight was broken. Was it you? No. You're not in trouble if it was. I know you get nervous and maybe you went out to go to the bathroom, broke it, got worried and tossed it. What's with the third degree? I didn't break any flashlight. Okay, then. Okay, then. Gonna have a look at the evidence. 
There's some broken glass on the ground there. Yeah, he's smart. Hmm. Huh. What do we have There's here? There's something drawn there. There's something drawn there. Hmm. Chalk. Pink. Hmm. Duck. A clue. Clue. Me. Here we go. Duck. What's duck going to say? What do you think it is? What is it, duck? I don't think it's anything. Maybe it's a sign. Yeah, maybe it's a sign for an it attack. Could be. It's pink chalk, which is weird. Okay, back to investigating. Go straight for the ghetto. Hey, Doug. Hiya. No. Don't the kids have some? You know, a piece of charcoal is a suitable alternative depending on your marking surface. Since we're on the subject, did you know that while chalk is traditionally known to be calcium carbonate, what's often used in classrooms is actually made of gypsum thanks to favorable domestic mining conditions? Okay, did that, not uh, know that. Carbon. Happy to be of service. Carbonate is what they use for uh, heartburn tablets. Mm, they use chalk. Right, let's see what these two have got to say. Have you seen any chalk around? Ah, uh, yes. Clementine loves to draw with it. Yeah, of course. Duck I'll talk to her. Duck patio. I was going to talk to Clementine, lad. He's got pink. Do, uh, you have any pink chalk? No, it's gone somewhere. Hmm. Do you want Somebody blue? Stole it? No, no, it's okay. Psst, me. I found something. Well, who what is, is it? I found this piece of pink chalk and a scuff of it over by the gate. Really? Totally. I was calling the scene for clues Yeah, and... Duck, I got it. Good job. <laughs> okay, Duck, go on, show me. Cool. Right. You didn't break the flashlight, did you, Duck? No. Mom and Dad won't let me touch any of their stuff. Lily neither. <laughs> That's probably for the best. Yeah, it probably is for the best, because he is a bit of a potato. Right, we got a clue on the floor. Was that a chalk mark? More chalk. <clears throat> Somebody was over here, too. See? I did good, huh? You did good. Yeah, duck. Rose did. next. I suppose oh, I should go out there and look around. You stay here this time. Seriously. Okay. Let's push this out the way so we can get out. See if there's anything here. That wasn't a push, that was more of a pull. Uh, let's push it back. Nope, that's not what we wanted to do. And that's not what we wanted. Let's try that again. We'll Pool. I don't understand why. Why are all these arrows still here? Why are you not collecting them? Let's have a look over this side. Anything? Don't see anything. Those bandits gave us hell, but they've been quiet for days now. Probably turned into zombies as well. Now who's next? There's a grate down there. Why would you assume that there's something there, though? <laughs> I know what's going on here. I know what's going on here. 
the bandits have stopped attacking so somebody's made a deal to give some supplies in return of not fighting back so who's the only ones that stay back Doug or the new guy Son of a bitch. let's go and find out the plot thickens who is the dodgy one in this camp You haven't come up with anything, have you? I came up with this. It's got a bunch of meds in it. It was in a grate on the outside wall. And there's a sign on the other one. Holy fuck. Yeah. Okay, we line everybody up. Everybody. Somebody is killing us. Stealing from that supply is the same as slipping into your room at night and cutting your throat while you sleep. You die. What is the difference? What if Clementine gets sick and we don't have what we need? What the hell? You don't fucking steal from us! Who the fuck is that? Oh, Y'all better get people your out asses there. out here! We ain't fucking around! What do we do? Oh, Lily. shit! They're gonna start kicking in doors any second. Lily, what the hell are you- Stall them. What? Just keep them talking. Do whatever it takes to stop him pulling the trigger. What is going on here? You made the biggest mistake of your lives! Shit. Nuggies, okay, gotta Enough go. Bye bullshit. bye. Catch you later, Drew, Paul. Stop Good night. putting your boot to these doors. Yeah. Hold it, asshole. Take it easy. I bet that what you're doing, though. We have more supplies. We can keep the deal going. Too late, shithead. We ain't giving second chances. It, it was a mix up. We'll make it worth your while. I'm listening. What will it take to reach a deal? About twice as much as you've been giving us. You got it. Done. Is that so? Well, I suppose we ought to hash out some terms then. I don't like no hash. Man, shut up, bro! <laughs> Christ! Oh, shit! Come on, Doug, grab it. Shooting, what was that about? Those, those shooting. Is get back there, smoke him out. We gotta get out of here. No shit. Get those bastards. Cover our people and get them to the RV. Right, let's have a look at this. Go around the shit with the rangers back there. Get over here, hurry! We have to save our witnesses. Get inside! Hi there, me! Help! Gotcha! Hang on! Where is he? He's hiding behind that van! Get your ass to the front! Gotcha! Hurry! Come on! Get inside the RV! It's gonna be okay! Go! Oh, Christ! Lily, get in the RV! Screw her! Let her stay! Please, walk her! Kenny, hurry up with that thing! The right valve! 
Jesus, are you okay? I'm fine. I'm fine. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. I'm sorry. Calm down. We need to figure out why this happened. Nobody died. We're okay, right? Katya, you're okay? We just lost everything. But we have our health. Cat's head is split open. I'm fine. Somebody in here caused this. Settle down back there. The bandits have had our number for weeks. This is different. Somebody was working with them. Whoever it was was slipping them our meds. They didn't get their last package, so they attacked. Calm down back there. That's nuts. Lee found a bag of supplies hidden outside the wall. It's true. So, Ben, I think we need to talk. Whoa, well, what? Who's it gonna be? Lily, let's think about this logically, no? Logically? The new guy who could have easily been a plant? I think that's pretty logical, Doug. You think I'd do anything to hurt you guys? Don't play dumb. Why ben, Were you Ben's hoping they'd eventually no kill us all and you could join them? Lily, come on. Why Ben? Why them? What makes you think it was him? He's always I think so it's ben. eager to see what supplies we mm. found. He came into this crew as stranger from the woods. It's pretty cut and dry to me. I came into this crew as a stranger. So you're saying you did it? Nobody did anything. I know I don't get wrapped up in the politics around here, but we really need to think before we start stringing somebody up. Doug, I appreciate your concern, but we have all the evidence we need. Doug's right. Let's just get on down the road. We can talk this out like adults. Why give someone who almost killed us the opportunity? Lee, you know what we found. Just let me out of the car. I'll go. I didn't do it, but I'll go. Good. That sounds great. Lily, look at him. I... Fuck. Jesus, I didn't! Look me in the eyes and tell me you didn't have anything to do with it. I... What's going on up there? I hit something. We gotta stop. Alright, well, we can deal with this now then. Why would you even hit something first? Because I'm not trying to run. Now we're just mangling okay. around Is it the safe? axle. Should be. Everybody Jesus. out. Jesus. Lily. Out. Who's gonna die? That's the question. Kenny, the RV has some surface damage, but there's a walker trapped underneath. God damn it. Everyone, keep your eyes peeled. You know what? We shouldn't just kick Fucking you out. Thing we should hear what everybody I think thinks. you should chill out. Please, look, it wasn't me. Please stop accusing me. I'm really sorry you're upset, Ben. Just tell right. us you did it. No! Ah, this dumb fuck walker. You okay over there? Yeah, yeah. Could it be? Son of a bitch. Ben, you have no way. other options here. Leave him alone. I'm not doing this. Come on, Lee. You're the one who found them. You can't just abstain. Fuck all that. This is nuts. We're out here on the side of the road. Okay, fine then. Kenny? I don't know. Fuck. Just stop, would you? Well, your vote counts for you and Katja. We don't need all these votes. What do I have to do for you to trust Thanks, me? Anna. I'll do Thank anything. You very much. I'll, I'll do watches for months. Huh. GX, you. thank you as well for the I'll get more food, more and medicine, son, anything. You Just think any of that is well. good thank now? You, Just let me stay, please. Broken, God, Lily. please. You're worse on yourself. You're pathetic. Look at you. He's broken, Lily. I can see that. Do we need any more evidence than this? Evidence or not, this isn't any way to treat one of us. I've heard enough out of you, okay, Doug? Kenny, what's it gonna be? Just give me a damn minute. Ben, you have until Kenny kills that walker to tell me it was you. No! Ben! Lily, this is about trust, and I've never trusted you. Tell her. 
Just do it, Ben. Lee. Tell her what? She'll kick me out of the group. We won't. We'll understand. Tell me. Now. Please, let's just get back in That's the army. That's not happening. I can't handle this. There. I got him. Now. Ice. What the fuck's the problem? Ben! No! from the windows jesus christ get in we're leaving this crazy bitch i didn't mean to it wasn't supposed to be him what are we gonna do with her leave her for the walkers ken lee why why lily you're not coming with us i'll die out here i don't care what you're a murderer lily we can't have on. you with us i'm a murderer You've had Lee with you this whole time. What are you talking about? He didn't tell you. He killed someone before all of this. He was a convicted murderer. Is that true, Lee? Yep. Yes. Fucking hell. Were you ever gonna get around to telling me that? You got a little girl with you. Yeah, he's not killed anybody the like what they've all killed. Get in, Lee. Let's go, you guys. I don't have anything left. Have the zombie. You can have zombies, as your friend. Doug. She will survive. Lee, a word, please. What's up? Is Doug feeling all right? Doug's been bitten. Ah. Oh. No chance. It happened during the raid. He's going to turn. What's the plan? You've never had a bite victim in the group before. I'm going to keep an eye on him and see what I can do from a medical perspective. We keep the same plan unless something changes. East. Guys. What else is there to do? We thought oh, you should know. Damn. Not that you've ever afforded us that type of luxury. Anyway, if you could tell Clementine, we would appreciate it. This whole group's all falling to pieces now. There's nobody left. Imagine if it was Clementine next. Duck is bit. Huh? He got bit by a walker trying to escape the motel. I don't feel good. What about Doug? Ducky, how are you doing? Gone, but won't come back. Because he was shot in the head. That's right. That's it's right. horrible. Exactly. Yeah, it is. I'm not too bad, I'm not too bad. I'm just enjoying this little story here at the moment, it's pretty cool. Uh, this is the third episode, yeah. Uh, we just actually left Lily behind. My brother almost died once. I'm glad I have you. I miss my parents. My brother almost died once. But he lived? Oh, yeah. It was scary, though. If you, I guess you've played this before. You straight away managed to get that correct there, the episode 3. This one time, these boys from the other side of town were hassling him. He was on his bike, and they were in a truck throwing things at him. Calling their names. Stuff like that. You've played it three times. This tough son of a gun, he, he pedals up after him, he catches him, he pulls his... Hold on. So you've played it three times, is, it, is the story, is the ending? 
ending of the game the exact same for every time, or is it? Does it change? The bike up alongside the truck and jumps and that's into what the I back to know. and starts beating on him. He teaches all three of them a lesson. But the truck's still moving, you see. Just as he stands up to jump out, it zooms underneath a tree and a branch hits him square in the face, and he goes flying out the back. <laughs> anyway, if if he can live through that, I'm sure Duck can live through this. Done it for fun. Fucking hell! What the Get hell? Off of me. <laughs> wow. We got something up ahead. Thought that was real there. He was just dreaming. Who did you save, Doug or Carly? Um, we saved Doug. We saved Doug, and then Road's Doug just locked. died. Lily, Lily went and killed her. Now we gotta killed deal him. with this. Oh, what's happening now? What's going on? Lily's an annoying person. Yeah, she's a bit bossy. She's a bit over, over the top. The father, that father, my God, I just wanted to hit him so bad. Hey, Ducky. Thank you very much for that. Is there any way to get around Larry, it? That's the Doesn't one. look like it. On oh foot, God. maybe. My head was... Can't really afford to do that now. This seems like a safe area. All this brush will stop anything from creeping up on us. Thought it was happening. I thought I missed this bit. Oh, there's a train on the road. Or a train on the crossing, I should say. Why don't you and I go look around? Yeah, everyone else relax. Clear. Stay close to Kenny and Cat, okay? Lee, if you come across anything to drink, uh, if there's a dining car or something, I think Duck's a bit dehydrated. It's a freighter, hon. Be careful in there. What? You think there might be something dangerous inside an abandoned locomotive? Hadn't crossed my mind. <laughs> exactly. First place anybody would go and raid. Hey, let's go and have a wee check. Yeah, Larry died of a heart attack. We didn't even get a chance to save him. Sorry, Larry didn't die of a heart attack. Larry died of a brick in his head. Technically, what would you have done what with Lily? What would you have done with Lily? I don't know. Left her? I've never seen anybody kill someone like that before. Yeah, you've seen a bunch of other stuff by now. Yeah, but not like that. Was it you? Was it you? Not this again. Was it? No! Okay then. You, uh, happy you stayed with us all this time? Yeah. Really? It's with you guys or dead. I would have died out there in the woods. Just like Still my class. I would like to know. You think this is better? Who is the yeah, traitor? Yeah, of course. Who is the traitor that was passing the drugs off? Okay, so we've got one left and one the right. Which way can box. we go? Okay, apparently. Door to the box, let's have a look. Oh, it's opened. Looks like somebody was sleeping here. God damn it. Whoa. Somebody's been living in here. Yeah, man. Shit, think they're gone? I hope so. Looks like this there's some water gel here. Used. Be on the lookout and have your guard up. Okay, there's the water. Let's grab that. Definitely. Looks unopened. I'll take this to Kendra for Duck. Even though he's going to be dead soon, but you know, what is that? A clipboard. A clipboard. What's on the clipboard? A map of where the train goes. I think these tracks might lead to the coast. Route 27, Savannah. That's where Kenny's got us headed. Let's just take the train then. That is that. Got nothing else. Looks like we're all all out. 
Let's jump down and see what they've got here outside. We're on the side of the train track. Can't see anything here. What about this side? Coupler. So it's obviously giving me the action that we pull it out the coupler. Obviously, there's got to be a better way to do this. Gonna need a tool. Looks like it'll get that pin out. Yep, there we go. Let's get this pin out. I have Shit. no idea. Broken. Are you kidding me? Okay, looks like we're gonna have to find something else. Derailed. I mean, if we take, obviously if we take this off, that's gonna help. Just want to see what the guys have got to say about it. Oh, oh, hold on. There's a, can we go through here? Yes, we can. Okay. Now we're up here. Two doors. No zombie. Good. This episode's fun. Not going to lie. Okay. Hopefully we don't lose any more people. We're all right down to what we've got. Three, four, five, six of us now. One's infected. Um, oh, here we go. Prime engine. Nothing. Okay, let's back out here. Obviously we can't do we can do some other things. Going to have to try and take that other carriage off. We've got four other doors to open. Oh, there we go. Some tools. Got ourselves a little crocodile wrench. Oh, we can only take one at a time. Hmm. Now, that's going to be thinking. What do we pick then? Looks like we're going to have to pick one of these. We don't even know what we're going to do with it just yet. Um, empty? Yep, that one's empty. Nothing in this one. What about the last one? Uh, nothing again. Empty. So it's only the first two. first one has the key ignition switches. The second one has... Three tools. We have no idea which tool we're going to use just yet. Shit. We got one. Walker, sitting in the chair. We got him. Okay, but I think he's dead. Did I not just pick? Whoa, 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 whoa. Don't want to use the gun. I don't want to. Oh, too late now. There's no way going back. Let's just. <sighs> Suppose we are looking. Cool. Yeah. Don't mind that. I thought I made a mistake there. Because that would have made one big bang. Right, so what now? Let me just pull them out of the way. Chuck him outside. I don't think this guy came back. Christ. That light is blinking. Push it. Push it? <laughs> Why not? <laughs> Are you fucking serious? <laughs> Here, look. Boom, there we go. Sorted. I don't it's know why Lee tried to use the okay, gun. I'll give you I, that. I know that. That's what this I fucker works. Seems like I was it. having a little panic I'll attack there. Damned. How the hell do we get it moving? I don't know. That's Mr. Amtrak over here. Amtrak. No clue. We found this in the boxcar back there. Whoa, is this what it looks like? I think so. This Ooh, horse Louis. will take us right to Savannah. A hundred tons of steel. Put a thousand walkers between us and the ocean, and we don't have to give a shit. 
I can't yeah, believe it. I wouldn't mind plowing through some walkers. What about duck? I wouldn't mind plowing through some walkers. <laughs> That's the spirit. Try <laughs> to get this thing started. There's got to be some sort of manual or something. <laughs> I don't know about that. Ben, if you what? could keep an eye on the girls and duck, I'd appreciate it. I'm going to make sense of these controls. Yeah, again, he's not looking too happy, Man, is he? This could be exactly what we need. Let's have a look at this. What is that, a manual? It's a bunch of papers. A bunch of maps about Georgia's cities. Nothing about the train. What have we got here? Shit, this is it. Instructions on starting the engine. Damn, uh, okay. pages are gone. Are you joking me? I can kind of see the indentations from the writing. Find a way to read the notepad. Um, what do we have? Need some we chalk. got a problem. What? We still got the rest of the train attached to us back there. Shit. I tried to yank the pin out, but it won't budge. Well, we ain't going anywhere until it does. To use a wrench. We're gonna have to use a wrench to rip it out. What else we got? We some neat key knobs. It's on the floor. Ew. Some milk. at the front of the train. Jesus! Jesus Christ, you dirty mother. Oh. What's he got? Again. Why would I use a gun? Don't use the gun. Use a wrench. Can we not use a wrench? Scared you, dude, it scared me. I don't know how many times I've jumped because of this. The very first episode. Looks like there's something there as well. Open the door. This door's gonna hurt. Oh boy. That's my plan. That door's gonna hurt, so we're just gonna. You aren't gonna like this. That's gotta hurt. Not that it really hurt him because he was already dead, but for a real person. What is that chalk? No idea what that is. Crackers? I don't know. I didn't get to see. An overkill for zombie. Exactly. At least it wasn't using the gun. That's the main thing. Who's using the gun? That would have been stupid. Anything else? Can't see anything. I think that is it. Get back on. Oh, no, no. What's at the front here? It's in pretty good shape for a wreck. Yeah, exactly. That's why I was hoping it wasn't just the gun to kill the zombie. The last thing I want to do is just set off a couple of gun bullets. Right. Let's have a look at... Nothing about the train. Nothing here. Let's see if the kids have got anything. So, which, uh, we've got the wrench. Give me the other side here, open it up. The pen is here. It's stuck. I can definitely pry this thing free if I can break it loose first. We can break it loose first. Right, so maybe we need another tool first. Now let's go and find out what we've got. Good 
to stay on, stay on the train here. We've got a 50-50 chance here, which tool to pick up. Yeah. I'm going for that bad boy. Let's see what this is, does. That's a big, heavy, meaty spanner there. Hopefully this will be able to break it. We can get this going. Now. Are you kidding me? Stuck. We need a bunch of force to break away all this rust and whatnot before I can pry anything free. There's got to be a better way to do this. Got to be a better way of doing this. Hmm. Okay. So we're missing something then. Not letting us do anything just yet. Mo Howard Sawa, thank you very much for the follow. I really appreciate it, my man. Welcome. Uh huh. What is this? That's one hell of a mess. That's all steel. Looks like it was going to a steel mill. Let's see if we can find something in the camper van we can use. What have we got? Pencil. There's a pencil. Yeah, boy. Now we can do the little, that little self shading technique. Still need to dismember the train. Must be something else we're missing. No, nope, that's nothing there. That's just the way out. Right, okay, nothing else in the camper van. What about the girls and the boys? Here we go. We found a notebook that we think might have had some starter directions on it, but the page is missing. Well, I'm sure you guys will figure it out. Thanks very much. There's a notepad on the train. Do you have any pencils or anything in your pack? No, I wish. Maybe in the RV. What do you need it for? There used to be something up. written on the notepad that I need to know about. Well, if you're not using it, I'd take it. I'm out of paper, and there's all sorts of new leaves around here. Yeah, that's not going to happen. Now let's give the water. Here, found some water. Oh, thank you. Perfect. He's allergic to bees. Is that right? That's all I can keep thinking about. Like... Somehow that matters. <laughs> Allergic to bees. I know. Well, I don't. I'm afraid. But you're probably right. I'm afraid he's going to die. Here, I found these. If Duck's up for it. Thank you. That's very thoughtful. He isn't fussy, you know. What? Most kids, they're really fussy about what they'll eat. Hate vegetables, that kind of thing. Not mm -hmm. Duck, huh? No. The most trouble I ever have is making him use a fork. Thank you, Lee. Sure. Nothing else here. Let's get that train started now. Nope, 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 nope. That's theirs. Got up these ones here, pal. That's it. Hmm. Maybe if we move the train, it will jar the pin a little bit. We'll be able to pry it. Let's get over here. Get the old pencil trick. And boom. You can read it now? Yeah. Should be able to just follow the steps to get the engine on. Sounds good. What? Okay, okay. Right. Engine start up. Six, five, nine, and nine. Right. Two down, two up. One up, down, up. Up, down, up. Two down. Unless you can find that first. Here we go, ah, here we got six, two down, two up. Oh, 
One up, one down, one it? And one up. Is that right? Son of a bitch! Whatever you did, lit the dash up! Right, we so got that far, one. so good. Right, here we go. Six is done. Uh, let's have a look at number five. Uh, middle and down. Now we're talking. Six is done. Can't do five. High voltage. Is that it? Some? Huh? Nine and nine. Where is nine? Is that outside? Six, seven, eight, eight. I think nine's outside, isn't it? Nine is outside, yeah, yeah, thanks for that. Yeah, I thought it was uh, this first cupboard. Way. One left and then one right. So let's go left. One right. Boom, there we go. We got the train up and going. Holy shit! We're golden! This thing's loud. Yeah, we are. Duck, though. Let's not talk about that. So what? We're barreling down the tracks at 40 miles an hour. I don't care about the noise. Let's fucking enjoy this. Let's get the train. Mom, let's see if she'll move. Still need to get the, the cart out. There's one cart derailed. We have to take that off somehow. It's all yours. Uh, what's... Looks like there's only one control. Okay, let's do this. There you go. That may have jumped it now. There Goals. we go. We're still attached. Can you go find out where we're stuck and get us unstuck? Yeah. Can I go out this door? No, we can't. Of course we can't. Hopefully the spanner is the right one. Three in one chance I've been the right spanner. And it's Yeah boys, there we hey, go. Hey Kenny, we're loose. Nice one. Now we got a free train, let's go out. You touch any of my stuff? What the f I took the map of the train routes. That's fine, you can have that. Really? <laughs> yeah. I got them all right up here. I guess it's no worse for wear. Name's Chuck. Chuck. Charles, if you fancy. Lee. That your crew outside? Yeah. Easy to and the guy crew. up in the cab. Him too. I saw you walking through here and thought about scaring the pants off you. What? <laughs> but I couldn't force myself to do it. I think I would do that. I would be awesome. It's still kind of freaking me out. <laughs> folk will do that. Already met everyone outside. They all warmed to me right quick in direct sunlight. Phew. I thought he was going to kill us there. Eek, exactly, Dustin. That's what I was just thinking. You met Chuck? Yeah, I did. It's gonna, so nice to meet someone normal for a change. We're gonna call him Chuck he Norris. He gave us candy, Ben too. He's so weird. You have candy? What's your game, man? Welcome. You're welcome. Thank you. You met Kenny? Yeah. Sure did. Man shares my love of the road. That's for certain. 
He's not doing too good. I'm awful sorry your son's not feeling good. I appreciate your concern. Well, with a little TLC, I'm sure he'll be fit as a fiddle in no time. And I can offer y'all whatever I got, although it ain't much. Thank you. I, apparently We'd you like had to joy. do the same. Why don't we hold off on that? Stay with us. We'd like the company. Apparently he's got more food than the rest of them put together, so it's a good start. Oh, he's going to play as a wee tune here. What we're doing now? How you doing, Ben? I'm just watching talking the again? girls and not working on a mega cool train. What do you think? <laughs> hey, sweet pea, that candy Chuck gave you. The taste okay? It was really good. No funny aftertaste. No. Train's cool, huh? Yeah. I guess, I guess. so. I knew she could. I guess. Kinda. It's funny because that's what the kids always say. I guess so. I think so. Right, how's the boy doing? The boys can't be. Right, how's Doc? Uh, Clementine said anything. Would you have left Lily back there? Oh, she said. On the side of the road like that? Yes, Lee. Yeah? We have to have lines. Yes. Doc, okay, thanks I very much for dropping her. by. Thank you very much for the follow as well. Really appreciate it. Okay, I hope you yeah. have a great day. Catch you later, pal. Hope to see you again. Has Clementine said anything? Has Clementine said anything to you about Doug or Duck or anything? I'm worried about it. No. That little girl is a puzzle. Yeah, she is. Poor Doug. God, where did yesterday go? Good question. Where did yesterday go? I don't know. You were standing right there. Are you doing okay? It was horrible. I'm fine. I'm used to it now. I was. It was awful. One of the worst things I've seen yet. I'm sorry you and... Oh my god, Clementine had to see that. Exactly. Yes. I liked him very much. He'd spent some time in Belgium. Where your family's from? Yes. Even further away now. I was dialed stuff. I don't know. Tired. Which could mean a lot of things, right? Yeah. His body's probably fighting whatever's in it. Exactly. Anyway, let me know if anything changes here. They already know that it's game over. Hey, Chuck. Howdy. Such a bad thing. Where are you from? You live around here? Georgia boy. You saw where I live. <laughs> you saw where I live. Why are you alone? Why not? Seem to be doing all right. Fine, then. I'm sorry. I do like being around y'all, actually. It's nice. You caught us on a bad day. Hmm. You still got a couple of kids, and this one's got a good spirit. That's some kind of something. That's I'll talk some to you later. Kind of something. Hope so. Right. Well, is everybody talk to? Let's see. So that's it. We're cut loose. We are. Seems that way. Yeah. Let's Great. Do it. Let's we don't go, got much left. Let's pack so up just gather whatever you have. Get out of here. Let's go. Want a ride? Well, it sounds like you're taking my home. <laughs> That's a yes, ma'am. <laughs> Haven't found anything better for keeping the creepy crawlies out than that boxcar. Duck's sick. Get on the train, Clementine. Yeah, where are they gonna put Duck? He's getting sicker. Let me look at him. can't ignore this. We can keep going if you want. We can keep going if you want. Damn right I won't. That's what we're doing. I think Lee just wants to talk it through. It's talked through! Get on, cat. 
I'll be up front. I don't want to hear any nonsense until we get where we're going. Okay, so what they do is they put the boy in the cart. When he turns, there you go. But you're leaving the little boy who's infected in the back of the train. You know what's going to happen. <sighs> you know what, this is not a good idea. This is definitely not a good idea. Gotta be hard on you, eh? Three adults taking care of three kids. No disrespect, son. <laughs> yeah, we'll be fine. It is. It is. There were more. more of us. Dead, get them. Yep. Yes. No. Oh, it's a shame. Lee. Lee, I need you right now. I need you to go get Ken. What's up? Would you get that off his face? My hands are full here. Would do, but it's not like me. Thank you. Could you just get that off his face, please? He's out of time. We need to stop this train. Okay. Please. Let's get out of here. Let's go and get the guy. The father has to come and sort this out. You need to stop the train. Kenny. What? Ken. What the hell's that? It's your son's blood. Your son's blood. Get out of here, Lee. You know he's dying. Nobody knows shit. He'll be fine. Come on. He won't be. I'm sorry. Wake the fuck F up. I'm sorry. I shouldn't talk like that right now. Go back there and tell my wife everything will be fine. What is the it? goddamn deal? He's a little sick, but we can't just quit. It's a scratch. He's not like the others. Jesus, all y'all are just making it worse. Um, stop the train. Stop the train. Stop it, goddammit! Fuck you, Lee. You gotta listen. Or what? Oh, God. I'm not doing anything else. Looks like we've only got one option here. Back off, fight him, calm down. Calm down and... How the fuck do you calm down after a day like today? By talking to your friend. My sons, are you gonna let die? You couldn't say shot or duck. You think you're the reason duck was bitten? Like you had this coming or something? Exactly. I need to get over it. You didn't kill Herschel's son. You didn't kill Herschel's son. Yes, I did. And now it's catching up to me. That's not what went down. You looked out for your kid. A bad thing happened to someone else's. There ain't no way this world lets my son live when I help put someone else's in the ground. That's not the way it works. You know that. Stop the train, man. Top Kenny into stopping the train. Awesome, there we go. We managed to get him to stop the train. Yeah, boy. Oops. 
you continue season two, three, and four. Yes, I will be continuing the seasons, but I will, I'll probably not be tonight. I'll probably actually Ken, finish this episode off. I think it's time. The boy's Fuck. been bit, in case you haven't figured that out. Take as long as you need. We shouldn't waste time. What do you need? I... I... Got you. Gun. It's time to... Oh, this is not possible. What are we gonna do? We can't allow him to become one of those things. But Damn, this what is if, sad. What if he doesn't? Kenny, I love you very much. I love our son more than life itself. I need you to hear me. What you are saying, that he may not turn, is foolish. But... No. There's... Come on, Cat. If you think of one, you let me know. Isn't there some sort of pill or... Something we can just give him. Stop it. Just drift off to sleep. Right, hon? I mean, Jesus, this is our son. I know. But we know it's here or nothing. Oh, fuck. Just who, then? You want me to? You don't have to. I'll do it. No, you don't God, have you to. Do it. God, you fuck. God, I, I, I can. can. God, I'll do it. I can do this. You can't. I love you, Ken, but... This is beyond you. I'll do it. No, it should be apparent. No parent should have to do something like this. Exactly. My God. He's right, Cat. We can say our goodbyes and just let that be it. I don't know. Lee, you'd be doing this family a great service. Why don't we take him into the forest so Clementine doesn't have to see? Yeah. Give us a moment. To say goodbye. Of course. It's been so hard. What's happening? Duck is dying. Duck is dying. I know. What are you doing? I'm gonna make sure he's okay. But how? He's bitten. By making sure he doesn't come back. Oh. Look, Clem. Things are... What the? No! Ben, take Clementine into the train. Go. It'll be fine. See what happened. What? Oh, you're fucking joking get, me. Get! Gotcha! She could. She, 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 she just. Oh, 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 fuck! Damn. What is going on here? He's dying. Come on. Come on, Kenny. You've got to do it. There's nobody left. Dad, you gotta do this. Just put an end to it, man. 
can you you can do it no don't look at them don't look don't look No, no, no. He's dead. Shoot him. It'll be okay. It'll be okay. Wow. Ooh. Damn, that is an emotional roller coaster right there. Now there's two more less. There's getting less and less and less people now. You want to talk? Uh -uh. You uh, understand what happened? Yes. Okay. What are you thinking about? It's what sad. Chuck yes, said. it is very sad. What Chuck say? That what happened to Duck would happen to me. The oh, fuck he did? Swear. Damn. Sorry. It took some sense into it. Don't be mad. Damn, Chucky Chuck, what you up to, man? Hey, how you doing? What you said to me, asshole? Why you said that to Clementine? I don't care what reasons you had for doing it. No reason to go and tell my girl she's gonna end up dead. Cause she is. I don't know much about you folks, but I can tell you as sure as the sun's gonna come up tomorrow. But y'all keep going on like this, and that girl ain't gonna make it. What do you know? I know that you don't have a goddamn plan. We get to Savannah, and then what? Find the boat, we'll figure it out. The best for Clementine. We find a boat. You think that's a new idea? You got even the foggiest idea about where you're gonna find one of those. Um, in the water? Sit down with the girl and hash it out. Find a map, for Christ's sake. I'd give you one if I had it. And if something were to happen to you... It won't. If it were... You gotta prepare the girl. Teach her to use a weapon, and for crime, and he cut that hair. What hair? I'm not a barber. She's a little girl. Like a gun? Are you kidding me? I'm not a barber. It ain't gotta be styled. Jesus. You got her running around with a mop that's gonna act like Velcro to any hand swinging its way. Find yep, some scissors exactly. in my pack, and take care of that hair before Walker does it for you. Exactly. And show her how to use a gun. Because like it or not, that's what saves your life from here on out. Okay. Explain to her how they work, and not to be afraid. I don't mean to tell you how to do your job, but too many people have died already. Yeah, he's only been here two minutes. And seeing another little girl die might just do me in. I hear you. A plan, a haircut, and a gun. It's good advice. It's something. Uh, Kenny ended up shooting his son. Where are you headed? You got family exit, so... Kenny ended up shooting his son out there. I suppose someone had to. What a mess. You said it. Yeah, boy. Where are you headed? Uh, that way. I mean when we get to Savannah. <laughs> I've got that a few way. ideas. Which way, that way? We'll have a talk when we get there. About whether or not you folks want company. Uh, you family? have any family? Out there, somewhere. Been sort of on my own for the past, oh, 14 years now. Damn. Sorry to hear that. Long no time. one to blame. You're homeless You're now. homeless there. Eh, suppose. I've had homes here and there, and well, they just don't work out. No, they don't do that. I like a drink, you know? Yeah. Got any? No. Darn. Be safe up here. You betcha. 
think that is it then. Go back inside. Let's see what the story is now. Let's talk to the dude. What you got hey. to say? Hey. All right, Kenny, how you doing? It'll be good to get to the water. Uh, about my past, you still want to get a boat? Uh, any maps in here? Are there any maps up here? I don't know. I just uh, want to look over one with Clem, so she has a lay of the land. Once we get to Savannah. And if I get by you for a second, Kitty. Can you just leave me alone? Okay. Hey. Yeah. You still want to get a boat? It's still the best plan. Yeah. It's the best plan. Is that really? Okay. Can we do anything else? Nope. We we'll need that map, but it's not letting us do it. So let's go over here. Back outside to see what's happening. Dude is still here. He's hey, not saying nothing. Hey. Doug saved your life, you know. I know, I know. I don't know if I, I think can he's bad. Like this man. Well, you're gonna. That's just the way it is. He looks like a bad man. Aren't many of us left. Yeah. You, me, and Kenny. Clementine, the homeless dude, if he sticks around. Are you gonna be able to step up? I can do just as much as anyone else. Good. I hope that's true. See you. Is that yeah. it? See ya. Yeah. Just full on depression there. Well, we've got Looks a bottle like of wine. Chuck has some booze left. The whiskey. <laughs> so he just steals it. Anything else? Chuck's bed. He's lived here a while. What's in the bag? There's some scissors in Chuck's bag. Oh yeah, because we need to cut the hair, don't we? They look clean enough. Right, let's get on hey, cutting our hair. Did you talk to him? I did. He had some, uh, he explained himself and made some good points. Look, we're not gonna let anything bad happen to you, but there are some precautions we have to take. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. Don't worry, sweetheart. Okay, what should we do? Well, we're gonna figure out a plan for when we get to Savannah. Teach you how to protect yourself and, uh, tidy up a little so you can't get grabbed so easily. I like that. Good. Um, what a crappy day. What do you think about Chuck? You need to learn to protect yourself. What a crappy day. The crappiest. If three <laughs> months ago, I'd known what you'd be seeing. I don't know if I would have taken you with me. I He's probably would have run out of either. food. You're damn near starved with me. I'm glad I came with you. You need to know how to protect yourself. Like hiding or running away? Got it. Nope. I mean, with one of these. First, don't be afraid of it. It's just a thing. Take it. But know where your finger is all the time. And don't put it on the trigger unless you want to hurt somebody. Okay. Okay. Oh, See? You it's not look. scary. It's heavy. You'll get stronger. To aim, you look right down the top, through that notch. Line up the sight at the end with your target. Is there anything else I should know? Aim for the head, take a breath and hold fire. When you're ready to shoot, make sure you're not breathing too hard. And then hold your breath right when you pull the trigger. Like when I'm swimming? No, just for a quick second. <laughs> I found that if I did that, it's a lot more accurate. It's exactly, tough. more accurate. I can do that. Okay. I'd like go. Thank you very much for liking the stream there. Really appreciate it, my man. Welcome. Hope you're having a great day. Good. Don't lock your elbows. Okay, let's take your first shot. Squeeze the trigger smoothly and I'll cover your ears. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. Yikes. You okay? My hands hurt. I don't like this. Let's stick with it, okay? Do I have <laughs> to? Yeah, no. you do. No, she doesn't. 
Well, let's go again. I shall must. Let's see. Close. Now keep it steady. Okay, a little higher. To the right. A bit to the right. Close. Now keep it steady. Boom. I got it. Excellent. Good shot. Let's see if we can do it on our own now. Up. Okay. Aim a little bit more to the left. And higher. Aim a little higher. To the right. Aim more to the right. Keep it steady. Steady now. Almost got it. Boom. There, there we go. you go. Nice. I'm going to try and get this first time, I'm guessing. Let's see what she's got now. Arms down. I did nice. it! Yeah, you did. Good job. I was holding my breath, and the gun didn't shake so much. See, you did good. They're not walkers, though. No, far from it. But you know how these things work now. We'll graduate you to walkers one day. Okay, <laughs> I feel good. Not so scary, huh? Nuh-uh. Uh, you taught Clementine to protect herself. Now we need to cut the hair. Hey, Clint. Hi. So you're probably not gonna like this. Oh no. What happened? Nothing. We have to talk about your hair. It's not safe. That's not nice. <laughs> what? Are you saying it smells? No. Because it does. Kinda. Do you remember when Andy St. John grabbed it and I got mad? Yeah. Well, that could happen again. And if it's a walker, well, we need to trim it. Just a trim, right? I need uh -uh. to cut it short enough so that it can't get grabbed. Like a boy's hair. <sighs> okay. You know, we don't have to do this right away. Okay, good. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. What am I here? We need to do this right now. Let's do it right now. Sorry. Be ready. Hey, Claire. Hi. Mind if we do this now? I guess not. Don't get It's a good, good thing. Girl. Here we go. Let's do you know how there. to do this? <laughs> uh, how hard can it be? How hard can it be? I'm going to look like a boy. <laughs> Just now. <laughs> so you did kill someone before. Yeah. You could have just told me. I wouldn't have been afraid of you or anything. I'm sorry. You've killed lots of things now. It doesn't even matter. Boom. Killing is bad no matter what. But you do it now to protect yourself. And to protect me. Yes, it doesn't do. make it good. But you have to. I do it because it's necessary. Walkers aren't people. Okay. I think I'm about done. I can probably tear these pieces back with some. Here, I have some hair thingies. You do? Hair thingies. Oh, yeah. I love it. Really That's how we say it. Hair sleeping. thingies. You got any of those hair thingies? There. All set. Exactly. That's what I'm dumb. talking about right there. <laughs> no. You look cute. And a lot harder to grab. Is that it now? She's got a little ponytail. She can still grab the ponytail though. So what's the point in that? So now we've got the hair sorted, the gun, we need the map. So let's go and get Kenny sorted. Maybe we give him some whiskey. Is 
Vegetarian Dragon, thank you very much for that. Yes. Uh, no, actually. It's currently on uh, Facebook and uh, Twitch as well. Just to let you know. Let's see if we can get Kenny to give us that map. I wanted to talk to you about keeping my past from you all. Doesn't matter a lick to me. Fuck. Just gotta move forward. Are there any maps up here? I don't know. I just uh, want to look over one with Clem so she has a lay of the land once we get to Savannah. How are we going to get the map off him then? It's right there. You mind if I look in there for a second? I really wish you'd just leave me alone. Okay, we can't get to it just yet. I was lucky enough to get it working once. So what are we missing then? Something got to be. What do we need to do here? I found this if you want it. Damn. Didn't realize I had it left. Thank you. Want a nip? Nah, I'm fine. Sure. Sure. Let's see what we've got to see. Ooh. Not known for its finish. <laughs> no kid. But it's cheap. Mm. Anybody in there want to share a drink? You let them know. Well, Kenny. Kenny will want a drink, definitely. Speak with Kenny boy here. Any maps? Chuck wants you to know if you needed a drink. He's Hell got yeah. some. Yeah. Yeah, we go. Yeah, that'd help. Now we can get the map. Now he's gone. Easy peasy. And let's go and see what's happening. Oh, thanks. What the heck was that all about, man? There was a map of Savannah in the cab. That's where I would look. I'll talk it over with Clementine. Make sure she's got a sense of things by the time we arrive. Good. Right, okay, let's go and talk with Clementine now about the map. See what she's thinking. me oh my god i knew it i, I was the one it. giving the bandits supplies what are you kidding it's all my fault jesus ben i know they said they had my friend but he was with just, them. Just stop. Fuck. Can when when you trust you? That, my friend? Yes. Welcome. Why'd you have to go and tell me that? I just... No. Just don't tell anybody. You can't take any of it back, so don't. Okay. Good as good as dead now. That's it. D-E-D. -D. That was just silly. Right, let's check the map out with Clementine. See what she's got to say about it. Hey, Clint. Hi. I want to talk about Savannah. Me too. And what we're going to do when we get there. We don't know what to expect. The city could be bad or totally under control. Exactly. The thing is, you and I, we're a team, you know? And a team needs a plan. Ah, hello. Aside Thank from everyone you else with the train stops, you and I should know exactly what we're doing. A plan. I like it. <laughs> Good. We should go our own way. We need to find the boat. We should look for your parents. I think we should look for your parents. Really? Yeah. You need to know if they're okay. Well, if they're not, what happened to them? I'm sure they're know. okay. There we go. I'm gonna go and help the kids. Don't give your hopes up. I think I heard them die. 
Yeah, yeah stay positive. Best to stay yeah, positive. Yeah, let's not just tell That's what Dad always says. Dead. Let's look at the map. If we can figure out where they were, we can start there. Looks like we'll come right through town if there's nothing on the tracks to hold us up. Now we've got a good chunk of Savannah here. What do you think? They always stay in the same place when they go there. It's, uh... Hmm. Hey, don't worry. We'll figure it out. Have you ever been there? Once. Well, think about it. There are a lot of hotels on here, but read this map and maybe it'll jog your memory. Hey. They've got really tasty desserts. It's called the... Um... Um... Something... Mar... Is this it? The Marsh House? Yes, that's it! So we'll head there. Yes! Yeah, you boy. we have a good plan? I think it's plan, very gun, good. And the haircut is done. Can I... We're all good to go. Parents? Here we go. You know... Um, come on. That's not a good idea. Sure, go ahead. Go ahead. Alright. How do you feel? Good. Better. I'm glad we have a plan. And you're a good little chef. Thanks. I guess we should see how far... Oh, shit! Hold on, everybody! Uh -oh. hey, what's going on? Uh-oh. What's happening? Kidding me. Fuck, 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 fuck! Maybe we could walk? That's fucking stupid, Ben. I'm just <laughs> saying. Hmm. I, don't don't know. I ain't got much experience with y'all's fortitude, but we could probably deal with that. We got a goddamn train. That thing's not full of milk, Charles. That's gas or diesel. Something that's gonna explode. You gotta get a hold of yourself. This a crew here. Yeah. This ain't shit. This. Yo, you keep screaming like that and you're gonna get your face chewed off. Are you guys gonna be trouble? Because we could have just kept walking. <laughs> no, we're friendly. Could you be? Who are you? Define trouble. No, we're friendly! Put your hand down, kid. That's what everybody says. We know. Let's give these guys a break. We'll see. You guys got a problem with your train? Yeah, you're standing right in front of it. Dude, it's a wreck. It's not so bad from up here. Send your buddy up to have a look. Anything Gonna goes sideways up there. up there, we won't let them escape. Hard boyed. Welcome, thank you very much for the stream. Like, my friend, welcome. So now we climb up. I'm gonna get ambushed here, aren't I? If I come up there, you better not be murderers or thieves. I guess you'll have to find out. A group of guys is what we need. They're what you think we need. We're doing fine. For now. What about when? Stop it. Hey, dude. I'm Omid. Lee. Omid. Krista. What's the deal with the train? We're driving it. Oh, man. So obvious. We're not in the mid for new people. It's been a bad day. We could soon. Hey, I'm not going to bullshit you. Our group is a little fucked right now. We had a bite victim. Then his mom took her life. And before that, just... It's okay. Oh, shit. Oh, bananas. God damn, you guys have a kid. What are you doing up here? Do you know how long it's been since I've seen a kid? Shit. What's your name? Clementine. <laughs> Oh, so he gets to swear. Well, this is great. Hmm. See, things are looking up. You're not her dad. He down there? It's that obvious? To me. And no, he's not down there. Huh. What's your story? I've been trying to get by. I've been with her since it all started. I found out I was on radio one day. I came across Clementine alone. First day all of this happened. I was actually incarcerated. Sick. Do you have any prison tats? I uh, didn't make it that far. <laughs> and everybody down there, they're cool. We just met Chuck. Ben's young and stupid. We just met Chuck, but he seems like an all right guy. You always have to worry about new people. I used to love meeting new people. That must have been a long time ago. 
We're sorry for anything that's happened to you guys. That train is awesome, though. That tank Thanks. is your real problem. We'll help you with it, but if we see anything we don't like, we're moving on down the road. Alone. We'd appreciate the help. You can't just blast through it, I guess? If you could get it down, the rest would probably be pretty easy. Yeah. We'll start there. We'll come down and settle in and see if we can help. Why is there a generator up here? It's empty. Okay, that's empty. What about in here? Folks probably had their way with that van a while ago. Let's find out. Can we open it? We got some tape. Looks like we got. That's about the only useful thing in here. There we go. Can we get it back? That's what I figured. Right, anything back downstairs again? We get the. Did we take the spanner? Quarantine. Looks like all we can do is just unhitch the trailer here, but we're not going to be able to do it because it's. Yeah, it's. This thing is mangled to hell. No releasing it. No nothing. There's no way I'm pulling anything apart down there. Hmm. So we're going back down then, I'm guessing. Let's see Guys, this is Omid and Krista. Not big on welcomes. Like I said, it's been a bit of a day. We just wanted to say hi and say your train is pretty cool. But we are not looking for charity. These two we could help you guys, though. Are you going to Maybe. That tank the down? plan is to cut that tanker down and be on our way. Seems like plan enough to me. You want yeah, to start exactly. in on that tanker? Peace. I'll get to back. know the girl for a minute, if Did you don't mind. Something? And why don't I show you how this thing works, in case something happens? Really, Ken? It's probably for the best. Ooh, maybe. Someone might want to have Ooh, a look Hammond, inside of that station back there, too. Welcome. Thank you Sounds very much great. for the Let's do really this thing. It, man. Hope you have now a fantastic day. Caleb, welcome again. Thank you as well. And looks like... Going in the train, going the front way. Teaching him anything? Trying to. What was he good to see? How have you two made it this far? You seem dangerously normal. Krista doesn't let us join groups, and I'm a fucking scrapper. I got the feeling she takes care of you. Please, I've saved her ass exactly. hundreds. Tens. Sometimes. Um, How long since you've been home? Like six months. We were on the road for a while and then, you know. That's rough. Our cat is going to be pissed. Learning the zombie. ropes? Gonna have can't a zombie cat hard, right? Home. There are a lot of levers I can't wait to use. I said if something were to happen to me. Maybe we can drive in shifts. We'll see. Talk to you later. Right, that's into sorted. Let's get out of here. Mohammed, thank you very much. Muchos gracias. Welcome, everybody. Thanks for dropping by. I'm glad someone's managed to keep the spirit. Let's see what else we've got here. Nothing here. Oh, hold on. What's she doing up there? Got a clear view up there? Yeah, we're good for a ways. Thank God. We need someone, anyone, to come along and, and exterminate them or something. Toughen up. No sh walkers, man. Toughen up. It's you, me, and now Chuck. Who knows what these new people have planned? There are going to be a lot more walkers to take care of. There's going to be a lot more walkers. That's what I'm afraid of. Out. I'm telling you, E, if they ever get a hold of me, and I know I'm not getting out of it, that's it, man. I'm just going to punch, punch my own out. ticket. Punch your own ticket? Yeah. Take myself out. Don't be dramatic. <laughs> and don't let them get a hold of you. Yeah, I did say this as well, Kabbalah's go about an hour ago. Definitely he was the traitor. 
they saw was the plan now. You interrogating this woman for us? Yep. She set off any alarm bells? Not yet. She's very thorough. That's what I like to hear. Hey there. That's a pretty useful radio for her to be holding on to, no? It's busted, but it means something to her. Oh, I understand. Where, Where are you from? from? Let's San get some Francisco. questions out of the way. Jeez, a long way from home. San I blame the one in there. He wanted the great American road trip. Well, he got a little more than he bargained for, huh? Who the hell is into Civil War history anyway, other than old white guys? Wonderful. You two will be thick as thieves. <laughs> what are you guys arguing about? What were you two arguing about when I was coming up the ladder? Nothing. If you're gonna be around for a while, be good to know what baggage you got. Back and the maybe house. we won't going be back around to the house. for a while. Is that where we're going? Is that what you're saying? Not sure we'll get that tank up down. Not sure how we'll get that tank down. Maybe ask me. He likes to break things. Okay. Careful, she's a crack shot now. You got this girl shooting guns? Look, I don't need a lecture. You weren't getting one. It's good. She should be able to take care of herself. Yeah, boy. Or yeah, girl. That's what we should be saying, yeah, girl. Right, let's move on. Go back to Old Mead. Hopefully, Old Mead can tell us what we can do here. I'll talk to you later. Teaching him anything? Trying to. Right, okay, apparently not. Mommy does not want to talk to us. Hmm. This would create one hell of a fireball if we tried to blast through. More big shit to move. So, nobody else to talk to now. Maybe we need to go all the way back up. All this power, and we're still stuck. Hmm. We can't see anything. Must be something on the way back up again. Let's go and have a look. Government work was going on here didn't seem to help. Hmm. We cannot do anything here. We cannot disconnect that there either because it needs there's something. no way I'm pulling anything apart down there. So there's nothing up here either. Let's we'll see. Let's go and speak to that dude. See what we've got to say again. We can't. Okay. Talk to you later. Mm -hmm. Okay. As that thing comes down, we'll be on our way. Yeah. And I hope we won't have any more trouble out of you. I promise you won't. Anything else? Soon as that thing comes down, we'll be on our way. Yeah. And I hope we won't have any more trouble out of you. I promise you won't. Hmm.
Hi, girls. Hey. <laughs> Can't talk to anybody now. So. What are we missing then? Must be got to be something. We can't talk to anybody. No, that's the problem. Here, can't do anything. What about not teaching them anything? Them. Yep, it's the same to. as before. Want Oliver? Thank you very much. Welcome, welcome, welcome. That's the door. Time. Talk to you later. Can't do anything here. There is nothing I can do in this. Go to the cabin. God. Never seen that there. It's right at the very Can back end of the map. Over there? You don't like the new girl? I do. Go to the cabin. It's like That's what you meant by go to the cabin. Like you said. Yeah, all right. What about Come that? on. Clementine and I are checking out this train station, all right? Hustle over if you hear anything. Eat my little. Thank you very much. Welcome, welcome. Clementine, you've got this in the bag. Right. So now we've got a couple of signs on the walls. Let's see what they've got to say. And not much. Derby. McCarby. Fine silver. Uh, so there's nothing really of importance here. Let's even find something else. Paint. Okay, Somebody why is there paint? Some paint? Why is there some paint here? Hmm. Oh, what's that? Survive. Survivors inside. Okay, let's go and find out. You should wait idea. for me before trying to open doors. Sorry. Exactly. Luckily, it's locked. We'll get better at working together. Hey, Clementine, you just wait for me while I just test the door. Nope, let's push. Mm, old Bert. Mm. Oh my god, we're gonna have the windows open up there. Maybe I could look in? Okay. Come on, Clementine. We'll have to find a way in. Why don't I put you on my shoulders and you can peek into that window up there? Let's see what Sounds she's good. Do. Hopefully she doesn't fall. Come on. Uh. On your there we go. Okay, oh. I can see in. What do what I do now? See? Have a look. Uh, what, what, what do, do you see? see? Lots of crates and stuff. Maybe we can find the key or figure out a way to knock this door down. Kenny'd probably have me pick the lock, which actually might work <laughs> now that we have the time. I think I opened it. For real? I think what? so. How did you manage that? Wow. Well, <laughs> She's so smart. Well, exactly. I'll be damned. Let's go. Be careful. I'm supposed to tell you that. Exactly. This other way around. She's supposed to be telling us. She's the one with the big boots on. Oh, prison bars. And now Damn, it's, dark. it's dark in here. 
Maybe I can hold the door open? Yes. I would like that. I'll prop it open with some. What you gonna use though? Um Oh we got a spanner. Here we go. There we go, a bit of light. Right, let's have a wee look over here. That's exactly what we need. Over there? Yeah, we need to get in there and get that blowtorch. Wow. Imagine that, a blowtorch just randomly. Looked up good. Okay. What else we got? They Head didn't have shield. much business back then. Hmm. Couple of crates, empty crates. Yep. Ah, there we go. Up, up over the top. There's some space up there, but not much. We're lucky I'm so little. Yeah, we are. That's good coming time. Let's go and do your job. You okay going over the top of this fence? Yeah, definitely. <laughs> nice one. Go on and grab the keys, Clem. She's so quick, nimble. Come on, scoot. <laughs> Behind you! What the fuck? Fuck! No. Whoa, 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 whoa. Come, come. Go, go, go. No, 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 no. I think I need a dentist after that. Oh, it's okay, it's okay. Everything's relax, fine. Relax, relax. Put the gun down. Wow, that was close. Oh, shit. Keys, now! Fuck, it's still locked! <sighs> that was close. Ooh. God damn. That didn't go so good. No, no it did not, it did not uh, go so that good. That was bad. We're okay. That was it's really okay. bad, that. What's going no. on? I thought I heard a gunshot. We're fine. We got lucky. Three dead zombies. We found some walkers. You and an eight-year-old versus three of them, huh? <laughs> we got this. We handled it. It was stupid when you're a prisoner. We handled it. Yeah, it looks like. What if you hadn't? I'm gonna go make sure the noise didn't cause us any problems. That's a good idea. <laughs> She's so funny now. I hope you know what you're doing with her. Me too. I don't. We're still alive, aren't we? Me too. For her sake. F Christina won't forget that. Christia. Well, let's go back inside and grab what we needed. We got it. Well, let's go outside now. What did we learn? I'm not ready for a gun. We learned not to be afraid. You have learned to pull the trigger. We learned not to be afraid. They should have got us. But we got them. Yeah, yep. you're right. Exactly, we got them. Fear is the thing that will kill us. You understand? It's a clever time we'll remember that. Let's have a look, see if there's anything else in here. Does it not like it? Nope. Nothing. Right, here we go now. We'll have to get that train moving on a go. I found a blowtorch in the station. Should make quick work of the coupling up there. Excellent. 
I'll come up there with you to have a look. Excellent. Let's go. Right, let's go up and get this train. Not train is a petrol tanker. Abdul Rashid, thank you very much. Welcome, welcome, thank you, thank you. Hope you're having a fantastic day. Right, here we go. Let's get this blowtorch on this. We'll get this tanker down. We can get moving again with the train. Shit. What's that? The hose has a leak in it. Turn it off, dude. I, I don't want my eyebrows burned off. Better plug that leak with something. God, we need something else as well here. What, what do we need? I've got some tape. Luckily for me. Hope oh, old. thank you very much, Scott. How you doing? That should be it now. Right, let's get this tanker carriage down. That's crazy. Look at it go. Just about got it. Thanks. No sweat, man. Jeez, this thing is close. hanging by a thread. The smallest cut and it'll go. I can't reach it now. Are you kidding me? Damn it, it was just about done, too. Crap. Here, the weak portion of the coupling's out of my reach. You think it'll be within mine? <laughs> no, but I'm gonna dangle you over that ledge. The hell you are! <laughs> Yeah, yes. Let's do it. God, you're a real son of a bitch, aren't you? Shut up and start cutting. Uh -oh. Is... <laughs> Guys, there's something coming. What the what? Something coming. This there's no into the house. We gotta go. Fuck no, no, Omi! Cut! Cut! I am! It's going! Pull me up! No, 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 no. Kitty, go! Shit! What the hell do we do now? Jump. Come on. I will say jump, 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 jump. We gotta jump! What? No way! Oh, oh, here we go. Come on. Safe landing. Guys! Come on! Fine. You stay here and we'll go with your lady. The hell you will! <laughs> <laughs> Are you Shit. joking me? No! Ah. Shoot it, need to do something. Oh, me! You son of a bitch, save him! Oh, me! She was at the dead of the front. Why are they showing the diesel spell or petrol spell? Why, why would they show that if it's not going to explode? Maybe, maybe if I had to pick the other one and left her behind her with the shot. Maybe, no, I don't know. We, we'll never find out now. We'll have to wait till the next uh, time, the next playthrough, to see if it actually changes the situation. that? Who's she drawn? Dech Od, thank you very much for following. Mohammed, thank you very much for the follow as well. Diop, welcome. Thank you, thank you. Dior, I can't actually see here. Hold on one sec. Next stop, 
the Atlantic. That sea you've got. Well, thank you very much for the follow, we'll Arslan. Thank you for the like, Bryce. Thank you for the like and the follow as well. Looking for them there. It ben, That's thank you the for plan. the like and follow. Really well, appreciate you guys. Ours. She and I talked it through. Uh, you'll never get over today. I've just gotten it too bad. You'll be all right. You'll be all right. I'll be alive, I guess. Blood in my heart, blood in my brain, at least. I'll leave you to your Bloody thoughts. choice. Please out time. cold like I've never seen. Ooh, what's going on? Somebody got a radio there? What the? Me, Nanny, welcome. Clementine. I got your parents right here. And you be sure to find me, whether Lee wants you to or not. Now, what I need... Holy shit. I thought that fucking thing was broken. Who is that? So did I. Who the fuck was that? If he's convinced Clementine that he has her parents. Y'all might want to rethink your plan. My god. Who was that? Wow. Okay. We're almost at the river. You want to get on a boat? You want to wait around till the walkers figure out we're here? I know I promised that we'd find your parents, but Savannah's more dangerous than I thought it would be. And I think that's I it. don't know how much longer he can keep on like this. If his leg gets any worse, we're gonna have to carry him. Or leave him. If I were you, I'd get out of the street now. Who the hell is this? Answer me, damn it! So when were you going to tell us about the radio? Who have you been talking to? You come back here, I'll kill you. You understand? I will kill you. Boom. The Walking Dead, episode four. That is the next one of the chapter. That was the third one finished. Let's have a look at what we've done. Sweet Merciful Dead, did you shoot the girl in the street? You and 60% of the players did not shoot her. Part of the team, I guess. We all thought the same logical reason why. Better with a distraction, we can get in, get all our stuff, and get out without getting hurted. Second one was left behind. Did you abandon Lily? 45% left her behind, like me. So, hmm. One of the lesser choices, I believe. Standoff, did you fight? Kenny, you and 45% of the players managed to talk him down. I managed to talk him out. Got the train to stop so we can sort his son out. And here's a big one right here. Did you shoot Duck? You and 19% of the players that got this far did not shoot him. Most of the people shot him, whereas I chose the other way around. A helping hand, did you help Omid? You and 40% did not help Omid. Again, another not a popular choice there by the looks of it. And there we have it. Another episode done. That leaves us with one more episode of season one, I believe. I think it was the fourth one. Fourth one? Yeah, yeah, it's one more episode after this. Which we're going to actually carry on tomorrow now because it is getting a little bit late. We've been on for nearly five hours, five hours streaming here, so we're going to leave it at that. Come back tomorrow and do some more episodes. Probably actually finish the first season off and start on the second season, unless it's got some DLC, but we won't know until we get this one done so anyway guys thanks for dropping by thanks for all the likes shares you guys have been amazing all the love thank you very much and i hope to catch you again tomorrow have a great day peace out au revoir namaste